pepperoni and garlic crust, and just bread. Sick. Okay, wait. Is this on? Question mark. <laughs> I'm so confused. Okay. It says someone can view this. All right, can anybody see this? <laughs> it says we got three people in here. <laughs> Okay, we got 13. That's good. Can anybody hear this? Can we see it? Is anybody viewing this? Oh my god, this is like so scary. It has popped up on my notifications. Like, did I really get Bruh, yes. It's working. Oh, it's working? Yeah. It's working? Oh my gosh, okay. It's not Jover. Oh my god, I hit my phone because I was celebrating. Okay, bro. That's crazy. I am so sorry. I'm so sorry. I don't know what happened. Every time I tried to close the stream, it just made more, but I couldn't get into any of them. Also, I can't delete them either, so I don't really know what I'm going to do about that. I'm just going to have like five live streams until it dies. Anyways, if you're still here, you're a real one. If you left, I understand. Um, that's so embarrassing. Wow. That's so embarrassing. Um, there's five? Oh my God. Jesus. It's literally awesome in here. It's literally awesome in here. I love you, <laughs> Dear God, okay. Let me get these drawings back up. Okay, thank you guys for sticking with it. I really appreciate it. Um, that was crazy. Streamlabs is not my friend. Streamlabs is my enemy like i i don't care i am I, it is such a bad app it is so unintuitive and like they keep putting like good features behind paywalls and it's making my life so much harder like please it should not be this possible to make five live streams anyways anyways we're here we're doing donations for Gaza, and that's what matters. So if you're still here, I really appreciate it. All right, here's, here's Iris, and she's got her little iPad. It's rubber duck physics. Don't worry about how she's holding it. She's hanging out. And then Benji's going to be over here. I get the highlights on there. Oh, the pizza will be ready in 45 minutes. Yes, sick. <laughs> and I asked it to be delivered because it's perfect. So, I'm scared of driving. It's <laughs> really foggy here right now. Yeah, while it crashed, Cheapy ordered an emotional support pizza. <laughs> yeah. Which is very funny to me. <laughs> I mean, I was hungry and it coincided with the Uh, okay, pizza can only make the situation slightly better. You're so right for that, and you're so correct. He's got his little barista outfit on, you already know.
here they are. <laughs> All right, we're back in business, folks. We're back in business. The live of 87 is so real. <laughs> and thank you so much for the dono. I appreciate it. I'm so glad you like the messer. Your profile pic? Okay, sweet. Okay. Oh, shout out. Ooh, I don't know if I should, like, I think I'm gonna do just, like, the classic ducky color. I feel like that felt the vibe. <laughs> <laughs> bro that was crazy i'm like the adrenaline i felt trying to get this stupid stream back i was like sweating i was fighting for my life it was terrifying oh my goodness you're not late um we had some difficulties you were having an awesome time <laughs> No, 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 it's good, it's good. I needed, I needed the, I need the, um... The adrenaline rush. Exactly. To keep you alive. Exactly. Keep you on your toes. We're back, we're so back. We're so back. It was so over, but we're so back. <laughs> you don't even know how back we are. I think it's funny that you can draw rubber ducks with the, the rubber duck flag <laughs> on the wall. Wait, that's... <laughs> That is not a helpful reference. <laughs> I can't see illusion, okay? That's really funny. Oh my gosh. Chat, we are so back. Chat, we are so back. Oh wow, yeah, no, it is, it is very cold here right now in the winter time. I'm doing all right with it. I miss the sun. I miss her. I was like driving to work the other day and I saw the sunlight like on the horizon and I started yelling in my car like someone got a touchdown. I was like, oh my gosh. I feel that. The two days we had sun with the snow. Oh, it was amazing. Was so I felt like a human being again. It was so, so beautiful. When I was little, I really wanted to like go to Alaska and like live out my dog pressure fantasy. Oh my god, did you have an Iditarod phase too? Yes! Yes! I also had an Iditarod phase. Shout out to Loving Balto. Shout out to Loving Balto. Balto my BFF. That animated Balto movie. Everything. Changed, changed the fantasy. game. That was a what, game what, changer. When I went to the. Why? Do you, wait, should we like. Is, is general locations okay? Let's not be specific. Okay. But yes, I know exactly what you're talking yeah. about. <laughs> I'm just insanity. Balto. Shout out to Balto. Uh, Shout out to Balto. Balto's my BFF. Balto's my BFF. For real. Yeah. No. I I love I love a Balto moment. Me too. I love a Balto moment. But anyways, now that <laughs> I'm an adult, I don't think I could survive the last few winters. I would yeah. Die. Yeah. Yeah. That. That Alaska's long. summers sound kind of sick, though. That's true. Bye, Dinky. I'll definitely get your drawing done, and I'll get that to you as well. Yeah, if anybody has to leave the stream before their drawing is done, don't worry. You will get your drawing. I will not bail on them. And I'll put all the funds together and put proof of purchase of where everything went after the stream. Good morning. Glad you're here. From Japan. Shibi was in Japan. I was in Japan for a while. Well, not like not like a long time. Just like a semester. That's still a long time, I feel like. Yeah, it was just a good amount of time. It was really nice. I miss Japan. <laughs> <laughs> Every day, I'm just like, can I just have a walkable city again? Shout out to walkable cities. I know. What a concept. You mean you don't like 8 billion lanes every day? Oh, about the eSIM. So basically those are to get phone plans to people who don't currently have access to them so we can buy them digitally. And then people in Palestine, they can activate them remotely. 
and then they can access communication, which is really important. We hate cars. We hate cars. Cheers. So true. So real. Real ones hate cars. All right, get one more coat on Iris's hair done. And then I think we are in business. I think we need like a little, little bit of blush just for the vibe. You can tell if someone's Red Warriors Walkable cities are just like where you don't need a car to get around. Yeah. It's like, I just, I miss them. I miss them. Yeah. It's like most, like you can go to the grocery store and you can go to like... Pixar's cars is the exception? What? Some of the Pixar's car is the exception. <laughs> so true, girl. Hey, but Pixar's car was walkable for the cars? If, if like you think about it, like the small town he was in... They had everything and easy access to the cars. That's trippy. Bro, why did cars have walk up cities? <laughs> <laughs> if you think about it, right, like... Oh my god, same Howdy. We have, like, crazy sidewalks that'll just, like, dead end. Oh, I hate those. Or, like, you know, like, when it just, like, leads to, like, a little island in the middle of all the lanes, and you're like, what am I supposed to do with my life? Just sitting in this island waiting to be, like, hit by a car frogger style. Uh, Tomater is my best friend. Also, the fact that everyone speeds everywhere because the streets are just too wide. Strode moment. So, it's like you, you want to cross the street, but you know that people are speeding, so you're like, I guess I die trying to cross the freaking street. That's crazy, Howdy. Just not be able to use your sidewalk because of the snowstorm. Because, yeah, it's like, what do you do? Oh, I've been there. It sucks. So it's like, for a while, like, growing up, there were various times in my life where we just didn't have a car. Right, right, so right. So you just have to, like, hike in the snow. Yup. Or, like, on the side of the road and be like, God, I hope nobody hits me. And so like, real. And to the bus stop. It's awful. The worst. Also, ice on the sidewalks, evil. It's so bad. That's how my mom broke her wrist. Oh, my God. When we lived, um... In a place I'm not going to say because that's doxing myself. <laughs> <laughs> when I lived where you live. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Esther, your ducks are done. Yeah, that makes sense, Dub. I was thinking about that. It's a lot easier for America to just sprawl out like crazy than it is for Jamaica. <laughs> for sure, for sure. All righty. Next one, we are moving on. But like, I've been to Costa Rica. Costa Rica is just like hostile to everyone. Really? <laughs> In terms of boats, it's not car friendly. It's not pre pedestrian friendly. It's just, it's, it's for the it's, birds, it's, you're bro. You're literally fighting for your life when you step out of the house. That's hilarious. There's so many. Potholes. Oh my gosh! Can my like camera not fall off? It's a bloodbath out here. Yeah. Aw, thank you so much, Addison. I really liked um, Yellow Fang the best. If we're talking warrior cats, I was a Yellow Fang girly. Who didn't love Yellow Fang? Exactly. She had such a tragic story. All right, sheep and a seal sharing a milkshake. It's us. Yes. It's Thank you. I made the sticker actually. All right. Thank you again, Copper, for the donation. Don't say lag, you're gonna scare me. <laughs> Don't say that. <laughs> Don't scare me, guys. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. Yeah, I, I love to just go for it with a pen. I don't do a lot of pencil sketches. Mm. You're so bold. <laughs> I have to be in some area of my life, right? Yeah. 
<gasps> Vegeta's back! <laughs> I've only gotten bold in terms of just being like, I will drive long distances to see my friends. Me. <laughs> me. I will hike, bro. <laughs> Shout out to me driving six hours only for a weekend visit. And that was so real of you. <laughs> it was so much fun, okay? I feel like long distance driving is better than city driving. You know what? That's fair. That's, that's my hot take. Like, I don't really care for cars, and I would love to live in an area where I could just take trains everywhere. Absolutely. But I'm going to be real. After you hit, like, hour two of driving... It's all the same. It's all the same. It's all the same. You're just in your little car vibing to your audio media. Yes. <laughs> and, and it's vibes. It's exactly. Fun. Then you stop at, like, a fast food place. Rest stops feel like hell. But like, just I don't really like, mind a rest stop as long as I it's might. not like dirty and gross. Yeah, but so many, so many rest stops are dirty and gross. And when you're driving by yourself to a place, it's really scary. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> I guess I'm just like, I just don't think about it because then I'll get scared. I'm just like, okay, I'm here. I'm Nobody just, mess with me. I'm getting my little, I'm getting my little protein bar. Except for the one time that that one person like. Okay, I have a story. I have a story about a rest stop, guys. Um, I went to a rest stop on my way back from a trip with um, Lil and Peepers. And <laughs> I had like an over the garden wall shirt on and the person commented on it, right? And I was like, haha, good show. And then I left, but then I realized I'd left my protein bar that I'd bought. And then so I ran back in to get my protein bar. And I was like, oh, hey, LOL, left my protein bar. I'll see ya. And then they took their smoke break to talk to me afterwards. And I'm an idiot. And I was like, oh, like, that's cool. We have a similar interest. They seem like chill. And so we exchanged discords. And then they started, like, writing poetry, like, mm. about drugs but then also about me. And they just kept sending them to me. Oh my god. And I was so confused. I was like... Jesus. I was like, I don't... I don't know who you are. And they kept, like, inferring that they wanted to, like, move to whatever state I had come from. Ah. And I was like... <laughs> Aha, uh -huh, that's so cool. That's so cool. Please never speak to me again. Oh, of course, Esther. Thank you so much. I I will say, though, <laughs> my friend from Virginia does not get, like, the fact that we don't like our state. That's funny. But I feel like everybody who lives in middle America, which is yeah. a huge... Yeah. Yeah. Just does not like their state. <laughs> oh, yeah, no, they, uh, I, I blocked them, um, after, like, weed poem number 87. It was really funny for a while, where I was like, this is just, like, a little bit too interesting to, like, just shut down. <laughs> but I was also like, what is happening? I talked to this person for, like, five minutes. You attract so many weirdos, I'm sorry. I do. Good night, Esther, thank you so much for being here. You are the best. Um... I do not have a group Discord. Yeah, yeah, I can draw you a jackalope for sure. I love jackalopes. <laughs> All right, let's see. Do any of my characters have allergies? I've actually never really thought about that. I should think about that. Fears, yes, but that would take a really long time. Mm. Because they all have very different ones. I don't really talk about like my characters like super duper often. Hi T! Yeah. Um there was an incident. There was an incident called um called uh called um um Streamlabs is not my friend and I don't like her. Every time I tried to start the stream it would lock me out of it and then make a new one that I couldn't access. Bro, what? 
The Seal Deer incident of 2024 was very real. I can't believe we're in the year 2024. Yeah, that's crazy. That's uh, absurd. That's not a real year. That's that's something sci-fi films put to make it like, ooh, the far Ooh, it's 2024. Years. Like, please get real. Like, no, it's not. Oh my god, when the freaking... <clears throat> Back to the Future when they went to 2015. And D- right. Like, which, oh, you were watching it like 2010 and it was like, oh yeah, 2015, the distant future. And then like 2015 happened and you're just like, what? And now 2015 was longer ago than I'd care to admit. Uh, <laughs> I don't want to talk uh, about it. <laughs> we're having a strawberry milkshake, by the way. Just yeah. so you know. I love strawberry Just milkshake. so you know. The besties. That's not a real. I, I pulled out my calculator. That's not a real amount of time. Oh, okay, yeah, okay. Sheep, you're in the numbers. 2024 is not real. It's not real. Don't worry about it. It can't hurt you. We gotta restart. Yeah. We're going back to year zero, guys. I think that's just what's gonna need to happen. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, stream went crazy. Um, But we're back. We're so back. If you know, you know. Were you there for the great stream crash of 2024? <laughs> I should make stickers. Um, I don't think I will return to DeviantArt. Um, I used it a lot in like high school, but I really didn't like the update they made because the only thing really keeping me there was that I thought their like layout was really cool. So yeah, that's kind of an artifact at this point. I agree with that, Dub. I'm so there with you. Also, I'm pretty sure DeviantArt, like, uses people's art for AI now, which is, like, really hey, sketchy. Hey, that's gross. Deeply sus. If I give you money. I do have a Tumblr. Yeah, um, I, my Tumblr is Seal Deer. I use it pretty often. I don't know what's going on in chat. Yes, I'd love to follow you back, Howdy. Yeah, I'm right there with you, Pale Ghost. I, it's, it's sus. Which sucks, because, like, you know, it was, it was fun. You know, I think it has a really bad rap, because there's a lot of weird stuff happening on there, but, like, not all of it was really bad. And, like, a lot of people, they were really friendly. I have met some really good friends on there. I think, like, if you just kind of stay in your own little bubble, it was a pretty positive place to be. But I don't know. I it's the kind of place where like I wish that like I don't know there was more moderation at the same time. I just think the internet is scary. <laughs> the internet is terrifying. Oh my god! Ibis Paint uses AI now. That what? sucks. That sucks. What? No paint? That's awful. It's um Ibis Paint. It's like a really nice like drawing program, okay, and it's bad. free. You could probably, like, it's a pretty big glass. There could be a banana split in there if you believe hard enough. I'm just, like, I don't get the insistence of putting AI everywhere. Like, like AI please. has some very cool applications. Yeah. But I don't get the need to be, like, oh, we can just compile stuff easily now. Right. Um, let's get rid of everything. <laughs> and also, like, I think, like, putting AI in the context of, like, um like, things that are, like, about, like, creativity, like, human creativity. I'm, like, why are you trying to optimize that, bro? <laughs> Who's buzzing? <laughs> what? Oh, all of my notifications just came on at once for some reason. That was very interesting. Cool. Not the notification attack. <laughs> that was a little bit frightening. Getting notification bombs by your phone phone. Yeah, I think it was like all the notifications since my um, phone crashed with Streamlabs being silly. All just loaded at once. Aw, thanks for the snacks. And yes, let's get some watermelons in the chat. Let's not forget why we're here. Yes. Can we get some free Palestines in the chat? 
My favorite color is yellow. Blue was a close second. Amberger. <laughs> I do like rock. Yeah, I like most. I don't think there's any music genre that I, like, I would come on and I'd be like, I don't like any songs in this genre. I listen to whatever. All right. <laughs> yes, you guys make me so happy. I just want to say again that I really appreciate this many people turning out for something this important. It like really just like makes my heart very full. All right, the sheep and the seal having a milkshake together is finished. Thank you so much for the donation. It's literally us, it's literally yeah. us, yes. <laughs> yes, I'm so happy, it's so cute. And thank you, Bren, I appreciate it. Oh my gosh, Lincoln Park. Do like the, the Oh Take yeah, the like the the people, like this. This is this. this. Yeah, this is like so the. Hard to do. How do we we got it. <laughs> we got it. Got it. It's it's a little sus. But, but this is so much cuter. This is like it's so yeah. Yeah. You know what? We tried, and that's what matters. Yeah, the K-pop part. <laughs> the K-pop really cute. Yeah. All right, how do you are next? It is coyote time. <clears throat> All right. Let's see. I love to draw a coyote. <laughs> Aw, thank you, Zomboy. I appreciate it. Like every time I draw a coyote, I just go like crazy with like the scratchy art style. That's because I like that. Like that's just the vibe to me, exactly. You gotta be true to form. He's playing his ears for his nose. I can see how that could that could come across in the beginning stage. I see, I see. See you, Blackberry. <laughs> Thank you, Vegeta. I need to get like my, my Palestine bracelet back up here. I'm currently using a um, Tombow brush pen. It's the uh, the hardest of their little like their Fudono Suke um, brush pen line. Oh, thank you. Hmm. I have to think about how I want the rest to look. Wait, what's happening in the SpongeBob fandom? Guys, I'm confused. <laughs> Do I want to know is the better question. Maybe I don't. SpongeBob popsicle. <laughs> Infection SpongeBob? <laughs> Yo. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> the internet's so beautiful. I don't know what that means. I never know what's happening with Spongebob. So true. I was one of those who, and my parents saw Spongebob was dumb, so they didn't let us watch it. I barely got away with watching Spongebob. My parents saw it was really annoying. I mean, my mom was also really, like, strict about TV time. She, I could only watch three episodes of 
any TV. I that totally tracks. <laughs> and so I just read books and I was an extremely pretentious. I love that child. for you. I don't know. No book should, no, no child should be reading like Charles Dickens. Okay? Bro, <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> um, the first book I ever bought for myself was Watership Down. Oh my god. Because rabbits were my favorite animal. Oh no! Um. <laughs> that tracks so. though. Yeah. Yeah. You seem like somebody who read Yes, thank you for reading of South Africa. I absolutely agree. Mm. <sighs> I'm just drawing a lot of coyotes on here because I really like drawing coyotes. Exactly. A little bundle of Yodis. I feel like I should draw one that's like not super duper stylized at the bottom. All right. Let's paint this bad boy. Let's get some more fur details on there. I've only played D&D &D a couple times, so I'm not a great source on that. I'm sure people in the chat can explain it better. D&D &D is hard. Yeah, there's a lot to it. Yeah. Shout out to our friend who just makes role play games in- Literally. And like insanely like intricate ones where it's like, how do you even? How do you even begin to come up with these ideas? It makes me like so impressed. Dungeons and Dragons, let's go. Aw, oh, Matilda Stigreen. thoughts on the new Percy Jackson series. All right, gang, who has seen the new Percy Jackson? I have it, but Sheepy wants to talk Percy Jackson. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> so, like, Inquiring I've watched, minds. I've only watched the first two episodes, for the record. All right. My friend and I, we watched it together, and she's a major Percy Jackson fan, and both of us didn't like it. And Ooh. each of us has only taken one, like, both of us have taken a single screenwriting class, and we thought that the screenwriting was the thing that was lacking. <laughs> <laughs> very specific hot take. All right, thoughts on the screenwriting. Thoughts on the new Percy Jackson series screenwriting. Uh, is it on, what platform is that on? It's on Disney Plus, which mm. sucks. I mean, I'll pirate the rest of it when it all comes out and then catch up. <laughs> yeah, see, I never, like, I never read Percy Jackson or watched the movies oh, or have seen any of it. Wow. Which, I feel like everybody's always like, what? You seem like the kind of person you, like, Percy Jackson you shaped. <laughs> I do. I read only the first series, and then I wasn't. I read it like as an older tween. Right. I, think I was like thirteen or fourteen when I read it, and I was just kind of like not as into it as my friends who had been diehard fans since the age like nine. Right. That makes sense. Um. Like it's it's fun. I also read the Red Pyramid, and I don't know if I like the Red Pyramid more. What's the Red Pyramid? It's like so. Um. The dude ended up writing a bunch of different book series with different mythology, but it was all kind of Bye, like maybe. the same premise of like demigods, mm. demigod children having That's fun. to live through the legends. Yeah, they're very fun books. I definitely recommend them. Um, but <clears throat> oh, Lil watch, uh, Lil watched Hello, Lil read the uh, Red Pyramid too. Yeah, it's pretty fun. I had a good time reading The Red Pyramid. It was fun. I owned a copy that had like half the front cover ripped off and I think we eventually awesome. just got rid of it. I really liked Guardians of Gahul. 
Guardians I was of the Hole. so into Gahul, man. <laughs> oh my god, that's one of those like I was such ones. a Gahul girl. Oh my god, Gahul was so good. And it was like the one thing that nobody else had read. <laughs> Yes! Oh my god. I was like, I was all, oh my god, that YouTube, that sounds so good. I was so, oh my god, thank you. I take that as a compliment. Also, yeah, no, the, the stream descriptions just please work. <laughs> yeah, I was so gahool pilled, bro. Gahool. It was, it was so intense. It was crazy, man. Those owls were having straight up wars. They were, well, they were, like, they like were getting brainwashing institutions. They were getting like, like yeah, they were getting culted oh and like, they were like ripping out each other's guts. Yes. That was crazy in there. It was so violent. It oh. was like, oh my gosh. Like the emotional turmoil they were going through was like bananas at all times. They were literally child soldiers. Exactly. It was insane. The mood blinkers, bro. <laughs> uh, that was surreal. That that was crazy. I Very love the Gahul books, man. Those were such a... Those were st vice grip on me. I remember like being on the bus. Oh my god, Narnia. So I actually, Narnia! funny story, I actually took an entire class on C.S. Lewis last semester. No, not last semester, two semesters ago. Mostly because it meant that I got to go on a trip. Um, which means that I know more about C.S. Lewis than I ever wanted to. Um, I have mixed feelings about that man, but I did enjoy rereading Narnia, it was fun. Narnia is a really fun series, I feel like. Yeah. I don't know, there's like, are you supposed to read them chronologically, or is there, like, one of those, like... It's, like, to... both. Like, you okay. can read it chronologically, but there's also, like, a different order. I don't remember what it is at the moment off the top of my head. Um, we read it in the different order. Oh. Um. Bye, Sasha. It was nice to see you. Thank you. Because, like, even when oh, you're I love reading them, soup. you kind of get the vibe that he wanted you to read them in a different order. Yes, I agree. Because I read them chronologically... I had this just giant, my dad really liked Narnia, so we had right. the series in Spanish, and this like giant compiled Narnia book. Aww, that's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> that's great, I love that. Yeah. So you had like, you had like the, the real deal, you were like, cracking open the tome. I literally, I was like <laughs> walking around with like this 800 page book, more than that. Oh, that's awesome. It was all in one book. It was all in one book. Oh. We just like smashed it into a giant physical copy. Wow. And the thing was heavy. And I was just out here like taking it to my classes, <laughs> reading it on Bro. the bus. I love that. I would have thought you were so cool. <laughs> I would have been like, oh my god, she's so smart. <laughs> She'd be so smart. I can't talk to her. She's reading the giant Narnia book. <laughs> Yo, I want minestrone soup. Okay, yeah, I will say, soup is my favorite food of all time. Even when I have no appetite and I'm dying and everything is bad, I can always eat soup. I can always eat soup. Valid. I am so soup-pilled. I... I'm a bread girly. That's real. Through. That's, like, the best part about my job at the bakery is that, like, I get uh, infinite free soup and free bread because, like... You know, when, when I slice the bread, the ends come off, and so we just keep them in the kitchen and eat them. Oh. And it's the best. I so, like, that, this, this is what I miss about working at the movie theater, because I fucking love popcorn. Yes. I was for a year, and I did not get sick of popcorn. That's how much I love popcorn, because they would let us, technically, we were only I do like bagels. allowed, like, one small cup of popcorn per shift. But, like, no. But if, nobody's keeping track. No, 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 no. For the record, if any job is like, yo, you get like a free food, but you get this much, it's a lie. You it's a lie. almost always can just have as much as you want because they don't care. Yeah. Don't, if you get fired, it wasn't me. Okay. But. I only knew of somebody who got fired because he ate straight out of the popcorn popper. Out of the popcorn popper? Yeah. Oh and my god, thank you so much for the uh, donation, Alex. And they caught him and he got fired. He only worked there. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god dub i have a story about that but i'm gonna dm you <laughs> because ah uh, because ah uh, um you will not believe <laughs> a dear cowboy that's so exciting i will definitely draw that for you chicken gnocchi soup oh my gosh yum also i don't know what my favorite type of soup is I really like, my mom's really good at making coconut curry, 
It's like a coconut curry soup and it's got like avocado and like peppers and like onions and like sometimes chicken. Oh my God, it's so yummy. Um, but I also really like, I like mushroom soup a lot and I really like just like a hearty veggie soup. Exactly. I love stew. I stop being vegetarian when the stew comes out. I don't care what kind of meat's in it. I will eat the stew. <laughs> All right, thank you so much, Hadi. I appreciate you. I was so happy to see that you were here. I'm glad to see the stew, the stew fans in the chat. You know what's up, stew gang. <laughs> Weak. <laughs> oh, what's up? Oh, is the pizza here? Yes, pizza's here. Thank you. <laughs> Sheepy's going to get the pizza. That was very funny. My family was like, yo, there's a pizza. Oh my gosh. I feel like this is like a giant party. All right, Gianna on Ko-Fi. Yeah, most people are here because of that video. That video blew up like crazy. The emotional support pizza, let's go. All right, Gianna, I'm gonna pull up your request right now. I forgot the S. Oopsies. All right, um, let's see here. Ba, 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 ba. Where are the donations? Or also I can pull it up here. Okay, cool. Ba, 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 da, ba. I've already got the app downloaded for buying the eSIMs after this, so I'm just gonna spend like a solid hour or two ordering them. My bank really hates it when I use Nomad to order eSIMs because it thinks I'm coming from somewhere else. So I always have to do like a two-factor authentication every time and it's really annoying. <laughs> All right, okay. Gianna, let me open up your request. Annabeth okay. Chase. Pizza. Oh, yes, thank you so much. Hey, Annabeth Chase, I know you, I know you know. Percy Jackson. Beth, okay, that's, oh, that's the girl from Percy Jackson. Yeah. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Okay, I'm, did you want the, um, hold on, let me get back on the stream. Where is it? Where to go? Where to go? Where to go? Uh, Gianna, if you're still in the chat, did you want Gianna from, no, I'm sorry, Annabeth from the show? Annabeth from the show or the book? Because they're both great. Because I know, like, the show has, like, a set design and then the book is, like, a fan design, I'm guessing. Oh, uh, no, they describe her very well in the book. If you see fan art about her, it's like how she's supposed to look. Okay, great. I can choose. Okay, I'm gonna draw from the show because then I can use like. The show has really good casting. It's just like the writing in it sucks. For <laughs> Hot take, there's just too much explanation. I'm sorry if you love the book, if you should love the show. <laughs> we accept opinions here. All right. I took a screenwriting class and I'm annoying. <laughs> <laughs> As you should be. <laughs> All right, let's see. Can, can someone explain, can you explain what Annabeth's deal is? Because I've never Percy Jackson did my life and I feel like I want some lore okay, before so I draw. Annabeth's deal is that she is like the daughter of Athena. Okay. And her dad's like a normal person. Um, okay, so she's like really crazy smart. Okay. Um, oh, the hot take about the demigods. Well, not the hot take, but like the thing about the demigods is that they all have like ADHD and dyslexia. Heard. Because um, he originally wrote the series for his son who has ADHD and dyslexia Aww. and wanted like more representation. Wait, that's really sweet. Yeah. <laughs> I love that. So he like turned it into like um. <laughs> This is actually like a good thing, kind of. Like, right. Like it definitely, Aww. like it still is like debilitating in some ways, but it's also an advantage in some ways in like the books. Right. That's really cool. Yeah. What's her personality like? What's her vibe? She's like kind of serious, but also is kind of like a smart ass. Oh, yes. Okay. And she's like super smart and knows so many things. I love that. Yeah. 
She's great. Every day she's just like person you're an idiot, and he's like, I know, but can you help me with that? <laughs> <laughs> I love characters like that. <laughs> Getting the eyes to look right always makes me so mad. It's the hardest thing ever. It's like, okay, she's looking in the same direction with both eyes. This is a promise. Oh, I see. This is here. By the way, the pizza guy complimented your cat. Aww. <laughs> Mabel, let's go. My cat has been pizza guy approved. And really, that's what matters. Yeah. Let me get back on the thing. I just forgot that I'm not looking at the chat anymore. Aww, I'm so glad you like it, Jana. Hell yeah, free Palestine. Hey -ha. Thank you so much. Oh, your puppy's name is Mabel? Mm -hmm. Aw, see you, Brent. Pizza stew. Wait, pizza soup exists? Yo? Mm -hmm. <gasps> no, I got pizza sauce on your heart. No, it's fine. It'll come off. <laughs> Bye, Brent. Thank you for being here. So also, welcome, Trash. Trash from trash from it. Oh, it's like bath from it, but it's trash. I see, I see, I see. I understand. Took me took me a second. Yes, pizza soup as a concept is like wild. No, for I real. Like You're so right. Tired, wired. <laughs> I really. Like it. The Western world really said, "Hey, what if um, what if we um, what if we just made life really bad all of the time?" Yeah. Just for fun. Just for fun. Or for oil. For oil. You know, oil, fun, same thing. What if we just made people suffer for our own endeavors? All the time. Constantly. And then we, oh guys, I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. I just like, I just like, I okay. had Another to, bro. Another will fix this. Exactly. <laughs> just as long as. Another will will fix this. I'm so sorry. It's like, well, what do we need to do in the Middle East to fix the Middle East? Intervene. Obviously. With military. Okay. Art lore. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. I, I missed something in the chat. <laughs> We're talking about, okay, pizza soup, art lore. Fascinating. Um, okay. Oh, thank you, Moth Soup. Bro, America's not helping. As an American, like, that's a part of why I feel very, like, called to, like, I don't know, talk about it here is, like, because I know it's my country who's sending weapons and who has the power to intervene and just absolutely will not under any circumstances. Like, and it's true. Ex exactly. Money. It's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. <clears throat> like, it's like, and, like, knowing that, US? like, our tax dollars go to that is, like, kind of sickening. Like, it's old news, but it's just, like, it's so, it's just awful. Well, and the fact that, like, Israel funds propaganda in the U.S. Yup. For, like, years. Like. Yeah, it's just, it's a hot mess, man. And I, that's just, like, why I feel like it's really important as Americans to, like, I don't know, make it clear that that does not speak for everyone here. Because it's a joke at this point. Yeah. For real. <clears throat> she has a really cute little- oh my god, she has like a little like stimmy necklace that's so cute. Yeah. Oh, they all do. That's like a camp thing. Really? Yeah. Oh, cute. They I get love that. like more beads as uh, so, like a form of like accomplishment. That's so cute. I love that. Mm -hmm. It's extremely cute. The show <laughs> it's like it's so sad that it, the writing is sucks. Because like good writing makes or breaks a show, you know. That's that's very fair. I love Scavenger's Rain. I need more people to watch Scavenger's Rain. Her I dad's ring is on it. It's both America's awful and pizza soup. <laughs> and thank you for the donation. I really appreciate that. America sucks, but American food is super is good. Bro, I love, I love a diner. I love a plate of eggs and hash browns. Literally. Okay. Dork Diaries. I never read Dork Diaries. I read Diary for Wimpy Kid, though. I didn't, 
I know I read like one or two books of Dork Diaries and I just wasn't that into it. Right. I did read the popularity papers though and those were banging. Wait, what's the popularity papers? It's like, so it's about these two girls that are like growing up together and they're like in middle school and they share a journal. Okay. So it's super cute. Like the art style changes depending on who's doing the journal. Right. And so it's like, it's like they go on different things. But I mean, it's kind of interesting because they're both. Um, so one of the girls is uh, her parents are like gay and adopted her. Uh-huh. Um, so she's like, I think she's Guatemalan mm. originally. But she's being raised by like an Asian man and a white man who are like a gay couple. And gotcha. It's just really sweet. And it like talks about it through her perspective. <laughs> um, and then it's also like her friend is like this um, white girl, like blonde girl. <laughs> it's just like sort of like their adventures and like how they see the world. That's so cute. And it's so cute. Like they, there's one where it's like all about their road trip that they take together, and there's another Aww. one where like um, the blonde's mom moves them to England for like a temporary job thing, and so it just is like I can't believe you're gonna go to England and be away from her. <laughs> and they like ship the diary back and forth, so you get these really cute like entries. That's so cute. <laughs> Oh, hey, you do not have to, again, I've said it before, but, like, you do not have to worry about, like, feeling bad about not donating. Just being here is more than enough. Oh, also, the reason it's called the popularity papers is because they're, like, trying to become popular. That's so cute. But in it, they, like, sort of get self-acceptance, so it's, like, the cutest thing ever. I love that. That's awesome. Also, oh, we're talking dork diaries. Yes, we are. <laughs> <laughs> Popularity papers, technically. Love that. I just, I don't really remember a lot from the Dork Diaries. I remember her just not being very Not the eagles. I get sad when I'm like, when I see a bald eagle and I'm like, baby girl, I'm so sorry. You didn't ask to be implicated in this. <laughs> I'm like, you did not ask to be like spray painted on the sides of trucks. You don't know what's going on. You're just a pretty bird. Eagles did not ask to be symbols of nations. Exactly. They're just hanging out. They're just chilling. People who have, I have guns in my car stickers are so funny to me. Because Literally. Like, Are you just asking to be robbed though when you're not there? No, for real. Oh, I love falcons. I saw a peregrine falcon on a slide last year, which was a very big moment for me. She was just like sitting on the top of like a playground slide, just like hanging out. Okay, this color does not want to blend the way I need it to. There we go. This paper doesn't like watercolor very much, but it's not gonna stop. <gasps> I love horned larks. Oh my God, yes. I love the one with the, the crab bald eagle. <laughs> This has so much more cheese than I was expecting. Yeah, they have like crazy pizza. I don't know, man. I order exclusively from... There's one pizza place that's so far away from me now. <laughs> that's so sad. <laughs> that's... We drive there, though. Really? Yeah. Where, nice where Alexa worked? Yeah, Alexa worked yeah. for the desktop, though. Right, that's sick. If the old manager is in and knows who she is, uh, like, it's because she's got those vibes, dude. Yeah. I love finches. Our pizza, our pizza, our pizza givers are a secret because that it's it's local ish. Yeah. It's too, it's too local. It's too local. It's one of those like if you know the chain, you'd know where we are. Yeah. It's not like Pizza Hut or something. Bro, garlic bread. I love a garlic bread moment. It it's is like, Annabeth. It's cheesy bread. It's not garlic bread. Yeah. All right. Let me go over with a second coat. I know. One thing I like about Tumblr culture, though, is when you watch a show, you feel the obligation to reblog a gift set about it. Yes. And I always do. Same. And I always do. I feel like I haven't really watched the show if I don't reblog. I know, I'm like, how will people know that I watched this if I don't put a little gift set on my little blog? <laughs> oh, <gasps> Dub, thank you so much. You were the best. I thought it was 
almost garlic bread, but it's cheesy bread. Oh, okay. Heard. I don't know. Poggers moment. So true. You have some pizza bread? <laughs> I will in a sec. Okay. I'm like in the zone right now. Okay. I'm on that like ADHD. If I stop, I'll die. Mm. <laughs> <clears throat> Which I won't, but. You're on a roll. I'm on a roll, bro. The one thing about watercolor is like I hate how long it takes to like make things darker without just like flooding it yeah. to do so many layers. Things I totally understand as a person who does mediums. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> Absolutely. 100%. Yeah. I know artists. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh my god. Oh. I have a mini painting to do. Oh yeah? Okay, so um, I work at a library and as one of the activities we do for the community is um, give out like mini art kits. Aww. Uh, like seasonally-ish. Cute. And so we ask them to bring them back so we can display them. Right. So it's like just tiny like three by three canvases and like people, people are their own worst critics. Like people always like turn in these really cute like works of art and you're just like, wow, this is great. And it's like, no, it's like a child could do it. Aww. I'm like, no, you did a good job. Stop. No, I'm the same. Like when, and like people are like that. I'm like, dude, kids are just like my favorite. Like as somebody who was an art teacher, I'm like, they make the coolest stuff. They make Stuff. No yeah. inhibitions, bro. Literally. And it's awesome. Like, I'm around kids so much more. Yeah, for sure. And they make some cool stuff. All they the do, time. man. They're they're good at art. They are. <laughs> I don't know. I just feel like way too many people are their own harshest critics. And it's I like, agree. It's not a competition. Exactly. Like, it's just a little community art thing. We're not expecting you to, like be a professional artist about it absolutely not yeah like celebrate yourself babe be like absolutely. i did a banging job <laughs> no one I has ever it. done art like this and they have it okay? exactly amen you get it yeah. you understand yeah that's my hot take, take notes just compliment yourself amen like unabashedly honestly it made my confidence go like to a thousand yes <laughs> absolutely you just, you just got to be like, I am the best at everything. All right, there's Annabeth. Thank you so much for the donation. She is here. Oh my gosh, I keep opening the wrong tab where I look at my 800 live streams. <laughs> I can't. It does look like you, Zub. <laughs> oh yeah, let me get my water. Let me get my water. Oh, you yeah, can I get some water? Yes. There, okay, there's like a giant thing in the fridge okay. on the left, and you can use whatever cups you want. Okay. You were a hero. Okay, um, thank you so much. My brother got me one of these, the, the Stanley cups, and it like scares me. Like, I don't leave the house with it because I'm like afraid. I'm like, I don't want to send a message that I like killed someone for this cup because it's a part of my identity. <laughs> so I just keep it in my ah, car. Oh no. This like thing really wants to fall over. Okay. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Next is Kofi. Um, let's see what we got. That was really fun. I really like drawing Annabeth. That was a good time. Alright, so next we have Kasolium. Ooh, an angel. Alright, let's see. We have a lot of Kofi ones next. Okay. So we have an angel and it says, interpret that how you choose. Not the I know the people fighting in Stanley. I'm like, no, that's scary. <laughs> Wait, really? For lead? That's scary. I hope I don't get lead poisoning. I don't get the hype either. It's like, it's a fine cup. Like I, it, I drink water from it. It's like, okay. I didn't know either, Dub. It was, it, they're like a, it's just a cup. It's just a metal cup. Like, I don't understand. All right, an angel. I love that it was open up to interpretation. <clears throat> so I'm gonna do whatever I, I want. I'm gonna interpret, bro. 
I'm gonna interpret so hard. I love lead poisoning. So true. So true. My hobby is being lead poisoned. You know, I just lick paint off walls and if it has lead, then that's just the place. That, that, that's a good day to me. Angel time. I don't know, shout out to my rabbit not wanting to chew anything other than wires. <laughs> He's so talented. He said, I know what I want, and I respect that. Nothing like $300 in vet bills. <laughs> awesome. To trim his teeth down. Gosh. Because he won't chew anything. All right, see you, Vegeta. <laughs> Thank you so much again. You made my day. You made my day. <laughs> putting some birds on him too because you know you know how it is all right one is covered in stickers and you will always be remembered Vegeta <laughs> you will be missed never forget all right let's see here All right, here's my angel. Oh, a pigeon. You're right. Pigeon. So true. They're literally birds that are domesticated and people still choose to have parrots. Right? Like why? <laughs> like you can have a chicken, babe. Exactly. And why wouldn't you want a chicken? Cowards and fools. Literally. Uh, yes, I am going to do my very best to upload these as a VOD as long as I can figure out how Streamlabs works. <laughs> Which I'm not going to think about too hard right now. <laughs> But I'm, I'm like pretty sure I can archive it from my own end on YouTube Studio. <clears throat> oh, thank you so much, Pastels. Appreciate it. Oh, bye, Pale Ghost. It was great to see you. Thank you. Yeah, that's cool, thank you. Your cat is so old lady. I know, isn't she awesome? I didn't realize. <laughs> like, I thought Missy Fusa was small, but. No, she's just like a little old lady. She's awesome. She's so baby. Absolutely, I love her so much. She's just a little guy. Yeah. She's just a little guy. She's like, your cat is the best. I'm like, it's not my cat, this is different. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, I'm like, <laughs> Uh, I would cat reveal, but Mabel's very picky and she can't be held, so oh. I don't know. She has some kind of trauma where she oh. cannot be picked up or she'll freak out. So if she shows herself to us, I will gladly show you, but okay. otherwise I can't just go grab her because she will get upset and then that makes me upset because she's a little, little angel. Good night, Sonboy. Thank you for being here. Ooh, my go-to coffee order. Um, I am a cafe au lait type of person, which that is just regular brewed coffee with steamed milk. Because I can't have espresso or I will get a migraine. So it's just like yummy latte moment. I mean, at least you're not like a deadly allergic reaction to caffeine like my sister. Yes. <laughs> yes. Clan gen? I don't. I have not played clan gen. Is that the warrior cats thing, or am I crazy? I, yeah, I work at just like a, like an old guard coffee shop near me. It's like a bakery kind of thing. It's a bakery coffee shop combo. Yeah, exactly. It's like if Panera was not a chain and also overpriced. I mean, your 
coffee shop is a little bit overpriced. The food because... is overpriced. Like the lunch, yeah. the soup is not, but like the sandwiches are overpriced. They're so overpriced for what they are. Exactly. Unless you get like the fresh mozzarella. Okay. Fresh mozzarella is pretty good. I should have contacted you before I yes. ate the sandwiches there. But I was just hungry, man. <laughs> we were like buying art supplies because I was taking the stupid book binding class. <laughs> <laughs> the book binding class? Why, why does it have to be artsy? I just wanted to learn like the techniques. And the techniques I had down, by the way, I can do technique stuff. But they were like, oh, you gotta take the techniques and then make like a conceptual art about this at like a master's level or like at a senior level art student. And I'm like, Bestie, I've never taken an art class in my life. Bruh. Help me. <laughs> and I have no time for I'm working full time. I don't have time to just to sit around and make art all day. Yeah, dropping it was the move. <laughs> I was literally dying. I was like, there's no way I'm passing this class. And she wants me to, like, go to activities outside of class. <laughs> I don't have time. <laughs> I was working literally six days a week to make up for the hours I was missing trying to get to this class. Nah. Nope. It was evil. And then I'm so happy I dropped it before I had to start working Sundays because I think I would have lost my mind. Yeah, that's fair. That's completely fair. I never gave her a reason for dropping it. I just dropped it and was like, bye, peace. You know what? That's okay. She probably understood. Yeah. She probably was like, yeah. Hot take, don't be a full-time student in art. Yeah, it's a lot. Don't, like, don't be a full-time worker. Yes. Thank you so much. Oh my god! Gast, hello! It's so good to see you. Thank you so much. Yes, I love, I love yellow. I love, I love a yellow angel situation. I'm always there. Guest is here, yeah. BFF ever. <laughs> the gang is literally all here. I don't know your online friends. <laughs> These are my Neopets friends. Your Neopets friends. Yes. Hi. My brothers, my brothers in arms, <laughs> in the trenches, <laughs> trading <laughs> digital animals. <laughs> oh, I'm so glad you like them. I'm so glad you're still here. I have a coworker who does digital Neopets stuff. Oh, really? Yeah. That's so sick. <clears throat> Unfortunately, I was a Webkins gal. So right, 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 right. I get that. I also liked Webkins. I have never played Roblox. Never in my life. I signed up for Roblox exclusively for the Little Nas X concert. That's killer. <laughs> and then I couldn't figure it out. Yo. <laughs> I wasn't able to attend. That's funny. I think I deleted my account though. That's really funny. All right, here is the angel and we are moving on to our next guy. Yeah, no, because I was so confused when you guys were talking about the Roblox face. I was like, guys, I'm scared. I don't know what you're saying. <laughs> I'm too old for the Roblox face. I'm gonna be real. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I'm, I'm too I'm too ancient, bro. I'm crumbling. I'm sorry. I'm crumbling. <clears throat> All right, now we're on Nena. Nina, Nena? I'm not sure how to say your name. I'm sorry. Um, Let me know if I got it wrong. Nena. All right, let's see. Petal. Okay, perfect. You put a reference sheet on. Oh my gosh. They are so cute. I love that design. Oh my god. Wow. That's really cute. That's really cute. That's really cute. That's really cute. See you, Trash Matt. It was great to have you here. Right? Yeah, it's older. It is older, but I feel like our generation did it. Or at least our like era of children. Was not really into well, see, I was in like the I was in like the such a diehard Minecraft fan that I assumed that Roblox was like competition, mm -hmm. and that I needed to like hate it because I like Minecraft. So I was like, mm. why would I play Roblox? Because I play Minecraft, even though I didn't realize it was like a completely different game. Yeah. But I hated it on principle because I loved Minecraft. I legitimately did not hear about it until I was like, well. <laughs> Like, I think I was in high school when I first heard about Roblox, and by that point, it's just, like, I'm not... It's like, that's, yeah, it's not happening. Yeah. 
I'm like, they're 12 year olds. Exactly. Plus, I don't really play video games. I'm like. Right. <laughs> I don't know, I'm one of those people whose parents were like, video games are too expensive. You can just entertain yourself in other ways. Right. You go outside. Touch, touch grass. <laughs> like, I definitely, I don't know, I grew up in, like, apartment complexes. Right. So they had, like, usually had, like, green space where you could also observe the children. Right. <clears throat> so it was literally, like, my parents would just be like, just go outside and play. Right, totally. Um. So I would just do that for hours. <laughs> And that's, like, how it is, man. Like That's how it should be. I'm, it was so fun. I'm sad for the children who spend so much time indoors. I like, agree. I agree. Just, yeah. You gotta go make potions. Literally. You have to. It's Literally. for your development. If you don't make dirt potions, it's it's not okay. There's just, there's way too many people who live in suburbs, and suburbs aren't set up to be, like, poor families. Exactly. None of the houses, like, face each other in a good way. Um, Agreed. Or there isn't, like, shared green space where you don't have to be directly in contact with your kids. Potions in my sink. So true. Literally. For real. Your camera. Oh. When did that happen? Just, like, a second ago. Okay, cool. I got scared. I was like, oh, no. Let me just... Let me just... You guys are going to shake for a second. Sorry. Sweet. Thank you. Oh, almost did an accidental face reveal. Let's go. <laughs> Just swivels around and like shows. Three seconds of blurry. Your that face. happened once. <laughs> Back when I had blue hair too. People were like, "Oh, I like your hair," and I was like, "Well, you weren't supposed to know that." <laughs> you weren't supposed to know about that. Or maybe it was when I had purple. I don't remember. It was kind of both. I'm gonna dye my hair again. You should. I just need to like lighten the bleach it currently has. Oh my gosh, it's like really not coming off. Yeah, I had those blue hair and pronouns for real. It was like a really dark blue. It was fun. It was a really good look. Thank you. Yeah, I had like, the bottom was like maroon and then it was purple and then it was blue. It was very fun. Mm -hmm. But it was hard to keep. Yeah. Bruh, hold on. Now, why are you doing that? Which, there's so many knobs on this thing. Oh, I found the knob. I found the knob. Okay. Yeah, this one was nice. It didn't really, it faded to like a, because it was such a dark, like a navy-ish blue color, it faded to more of just like a really pastel baby blue when I bleached it again, which was really nice. And now it's a whole different ball game. Now you're just in a different... I'm in my Cruella world right now. <laughs> it's like a good, it's like, it's like a good look. Thank you. I, it's my favorite so far. Yeah. Yeah. This is, this is my current vibe. I don't know if I could go back to like having like colored hair in front of my face. Right. Cause when I had like the ombre, I would like turn around and be like, what, what, why is my hair light colored? Right. <laughs> That's how it was when I dyed the, this part black. When I like cut my hair, I was like, yo, whose hair is that? <laughs> <laughs> Literally, it's just like you turn around, you're just like, what? And then it's like, oh, it's my hair. Yeah. Jump scared by my own hair. I know. I was like, bro, what? My hair is not black. Say psych right now. Say psych. I don't know. I don't know. I've never dyed my bangs, but I don't think I could do that. That would be a lot. That would be like a bit of an existential crisis. You have to go through so much. Right, for sure. I don't know. I think I'm going to grow. I kind of want to try and like do the... the fringe the tool <gasps> the bang look. yes it's so cute it's so cute that would look cute yeah i don't know but i gotta find a good hairstylist <laughs> there's so many that just don't know what they're doing there's so <laughs> many that are guard. terrified of bangs i've had bangs my whole life and you can feel the fear when you're like can you just trim up my bangs <laughs> and they're just like <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, I've had bad bangs before. It's okay. They grow out in two weeks. I know how the drill. I've had bangs my whole life. That's really funny. I, I promise you I won't be mad. <laughs> just, just trim them up. <laughs> <gasps> I don't know. I know they gave somebody like a bad bob one time and they were really mad. <laughs> That's hilarious. Yeah, <laughs> that'll do like, it. Yeah. So every time I am like, can you please trim my bangs? They're just like panic attack. <laughs> <laughs> 
It's so funny. Poor soul. I don't know. I feel like they just get in the, I've cut the same haircut of 43 people, and this is just what I know how to do now. Right. Sort of moment. That makes sense. But it's always fun when you get somebody who, like, wants to do something else. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, it, bleach, like, can, like, it depends on, like, it's not healthy for your hair. Let's just say that. Yeah. You are kind of killing it. Um, I have, like, pretty thick hair, so, like, luckily mine can handle it pretty well. Um, but, like, it doesn't, like, people are like, it's going to melt, and it's, it's, like, it's not going to break. It's just, like. Well, if you do it correctly. Exactly. If you, like, mess it up and leave it on your hair for too long, it does have the possibility of. Yes. Completely. Because, essentially, with bleach, it just sort of, like is a thing that breaks down the chemicals in your hair that make your hair color with the color it is. Yes. So that can also like mess with like hair texture or if you've had like Clean. other chemicals in your hair, it can yes. cause adverse reactions. Thank you. Bark, 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 um, bark. Oh, I meant to give that to your sister. Oh, okay. Could you take that back with you? It's a sticker from uh, one of the artists in Cleveland um, we were visiting. Yeah. There was like a cute little art fair back when I saw um, Emily. Yeah. So bleach like can mess up your hair pretty bad, but it's just like be careful with it. Absolutely. And if you can afford it, get it done at a salon. So if it does completely mess it up, you can at least like get your monies back. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> and be like, you completely ruined my hair. Please give me like my refund. Yes. Um. <laughs> For or, sure. At the very least, just not spend it. Because if you, like, pay for your own bleach materials, <laughs> right. then you're out that amount of money. <laughs> Absolutely. Meanwhile, I Yeah, I bleach my own, but, like, it it is a risk. Yeah. It's a risk that I knowingly take that has emotional damages. <laughs> That's fair, Howdy. That's fair. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Like, being, like... Yes. Oh, yeah. I wish I was brave enough to bleach my own hair because I feel like I would do more stuff with it. Right. Yeah, I, I think, like, once you get over, like, the fear of doing it yourself, and, like, I, like, I just kind of, like, okay, whatever happens, happens, and then I'll fix it. And that makes it a lot less, like, I assume that it's not going to go perfect the first time. Yeah. And, I mean, I guess you can always just go to a salon and be like, I did it. I did do it myself, and I messed it up. Help. Exactly. Exactly. <clears throat> But if you don't mess it up, then it's like, <laughs> yo, I forgot when that happened. We messed up my hair really bad when I was visiting Lil. Oh, I remember that. Remember yes. But like, we fixed it. We fixed it. It's it, okay. it, it went completely fine after that. It's all fixable. I have an under dye right now. That's so smart, Howdy. Yes, I love the under dye. It's fun. <laughs> I like how it looks in a braid. Yeah, same. <laughs> You're so right. <laughs> Season one seal. Real ones, no. The real ones. Back in the olden days. If you don't know, you're not a true fan. <laughs> true seal beer fan. Hey, I've been here since day one. Exactly. <laughs> I was like, hey guys, I'm putting... Back when I just uploaded videos to show you guys because it was Literally. easier. <laughs> <laughs> you little animation doodles from when yes. we like, mini iPads. Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah, I made a YouTube mostly just because I was like... It was easier than like trying to upload things onto like Discord. Wait, we were on Skype then. Skype, yeah, we were on Skype. Oh, Ugh. gross. Uh, oh, thank you. Um, yeah, no, I could never log on to Skype ever again. Absolutely not. I had to once for like oh. uh, an internship thing, and I was just like, never Dang. again, never I'm again. That being said, I also hate Microsoft Teams. Yes, absolutely. Zoom is only acceptable because it actually has a classroom light, like setup that makes sense. Yes. A Microsoft Teams is just evil. I agree. For teaching. I agree. Literally Skype trauma. But yeah, for real. I think everybody in our like vague, like late Zoomer generation has a Skype trauma incident of some kind. Literally. 
I think we all have it. I think we all have it. It's because I think it was like the accessible platform. <laughs> it was, exactly. Like I'm in the sure. same way that I'm sure that like a lot of people now have like Discord dramas. Yeah, for sure. Because we're just enacting our lives well, through like, them. The people before us, like MSN Messenger. Oh my gosh, I remember Messenger. I remember my dad. My brother and I used to text each other in the house on that. <laughs> we only have one computer when we have Messenger. That's but so... my dad would like text my uncle on it. Aw. Yeah. Good stuff. I don't, know. I don't think my grandparents ever figured out how to use a computer. You know what? Bliss. Like, my grandmother has a phone, but I don't think she knows how to use it outside of WhatsApp. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> She's like, I barely understand WhatsApp and that's it. And you know what? Honestly, respect. That being said, Zoomers that only know how to use their phone, side eye. <laughs> Please learn hardware. The amount, okay, I feel like working in a public library where I have to like tech assist people every day of my life. There's like the, like the two extremes of people that only barely know how to use their phone. And it's like, an 80 year old man whose grandchildren bought him this phone so he would have some form of communication with people <laughs> um, and it's like grandpa we got you this so we can call you right they're, this is the cheapest phone or right. they went to like a phone company and they were like this is the cheapest phone and they're like why does it have to be a touch phone <laughs> and it's like because that's just how it is and they're like okay i guess i need this now and then there's like the youngish people who have never really used a computer Oh my god. But have used like a tablet and a phone, and then that's it. Or like right. a Google computer at the most. Right. Which is just a tablet with a keyboard. Oh my gosh. Yeah, for sure. Like people were yelling about not teaching the kids cursive. I'm yelling about not teaching the kids how to type. That's real. I had to go on Mavis Beacon, man. You, you, I you was did not. Mavis Beaconed up. I had the highest words per minute in my class. <laughs> in like you know i don't know the fifth grade playing typing games dude the typing games were awesome the typing games are so much fun they made me so angry yeah oh my gosh anyways the children don't know how to type and um, the people do not know how to use anything <laughs> that's their phone concerning it's concerning concerning Shout out to this one patron I had that did a whole Excel sheet by herself on the computer wow. and could not figure out how to print it. Yo. <laughs> Dang. <laughs> I'm kind of impressed. I was, I don't know, it was just something where she just, like, she took it, she had, like, the Excel sheet on her phone, like, a, like a picture of it or something, and then she got on the computer and made the Excel sheet, and then she was like, okay, I need you to help me with, like, this technical, with, like, emailing it or something. And I'm like, Bestie, what? That's so funny. It was like a super, super simple thing. It was either printing it or emailing it. And I was like, this is the easiest thing ever. Oh, no. And she's like, I'm just not very tech savvy. And I'm like, you you did the Excel sheet, though. And she's like, yeah, I can do this. And I'm like, but what? <laughs> you know what? Fair enough. She knew her lane. <laughs> I'm just like, I don't. The kind of people who like are like, I know how to do one thing on the computer and nothing else. <laughs> I, I mean, I respect it. <laughs> it's like, yeah, you know what's up. You know your thing. You know your thing. I respect that. But, like, do you not have curiosity about it? <laughs> All right, we're on to Sharky. Okay. OC11. All right. No, Evelyn, Evelyn. Oh, cool. I like this design. That's sick. I don't know. I just have questions about people's lives. <laughs> I think that's fair. Working with the public will definitely do that to you. Yeah. This is such a fun character. What the heck? I don't know. There's also a huge amount of people who made it to, like, retirement age and never once in the jobs that they worked in that they have to use a computer. Right. So they never got internet in their homes or never had to use a computer until some point in time they, the person was like, can you email me this files for, like tax reasons <laughs> and they're like can i do a what now <laughs> i'm sorry a who can we, uh, huh? that's me i hate emails i hate getting an email never email me emails are evil every day there are emails or they have to fax something it's 
crazy. We get people faxing every day. Oh, wow. See, I would not know how to fax something. It's not hard. I mean, I didn't know how to fax anything either. Mm. But it's literally, you, it's like emailing, but like slower. That makes sense. You just that pop tracks. in a number instead of an email. Right. And it, it's literally the same thing. It's nice because, like, you know they're getting a physical document at the end of it. Right. For sure. Just, like, you're just printing. It's like you're sending an email, but the email is a physical thing. Yeah. Does that make sense? That does make sense. Yeah. Guys, we're learning how to fax. Yeah. Together. Take my hand. <laughs> we're faxing. <laughs> this is what I have to do every day of my life and guide everyone of all ages through the faxing process. Incredible. <clears throat> Incredible stuff. I had a lot, I've had a lot of people who really legitimately, I had one lady come in oh, and she you. was like, can you like help me print off my phone? And then I was explaining like the process of printing off the phone and then she was just like, never mind, I can't do this, bye. Oh honey. <laughs> and I was just like, I wasn't just going to leave you to do it by yourself. Aw, thank you so much Gas and thank you so much Bottle for Life. I really appreciate it. We got like through most of the explanation. And then I was like, Aww, and then you go. she got nervous. <laughs> she was like literally hyperventilating a little Aww. bit. And I'm like, I promise you it's not that deep. Wow, that's so, that's me, man. Sometimes I will just bail. Sometimes I'll be like, you know what? <laughs> I'm taking the L, I'm going, I'm, I'm, I'm leaving the situation. I've brought dishonor on my people. I'm, I'm peacing out. But it's really just like, I will hold your hand. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> They're, they literally pay me to hold your hand through this process. This it's is um, Sharky's character. <clears throat> and yes, I am still taking donations. Uh, I, ha I don't know how many... Can one of my mods check how many I have left? Um, we are going to... Um, just keep going as long as I have the spoons for it. And then if I don't get to your drawing on the stream, I will post them. Or if you want to give me a way to contact you, if you do Ko-Fi, I can send you a Ko-Fi. Yes, it's Sharky's character. I really like this character's design. Oh shoot, I'm going to have to pull up my chat on something else my pc's running low no. but i'm pretty sure that my phone will die if i unplug it again uh, it's on like 56 percent i mean if we can find a plug in the wall i can use my computer charger for your computer oh right 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 oh, right, right. You just no wait it can't unplug the computer because it doesn't work right <laughs> i was like wait why can't we do that <laughs> <laughs> because i have a stupid three-pronged um, I could also grab my iPad and just use that to look at the stream comments. That is true. Which also works fine. It's like right here under the Osprey. <laughs> you know, the Osprey. The Osprey, yeah. We've all seen him. We all know what to do. We all know the Osprey. <laughs> <sighs> A pink and green cat with four eyes. Absolutely. That sounds very exciting. I still, I still never got through my permission with the, with the werewolf crying about the candy bar. Oh, <laughs> yes, I remember that one. I keep so on, like, sick. Trying to commission my friends, and then they're like, "Oh yeah, cool." <laughs> and then we just ne never hear back about the commission. Oh, the markers! I can show you guys the markers. Um, these are Ardex markers. They sent me these, which was cool. Um, and then these are Prismacolors. And these are pro markers. <laughs> the Warriors fan club. All right, see ya, Howdy. Thank you so, so much for being here. Also, I know you have a long drive. You do not have to stay a million yeah. years. <laughs> I'm just like, I should probably get going somewhat soon. But I also want you to eat some of the pizza. I will. I will. I will eat some pizza. Okay. After this drawing, I will eat some pizza. <clears throat> Go. All right. Um, Are you working this weekend? Uh, yeah, I work on Sunday. Oh, okay. I, they just did not put me on the schedule this week. And I was like, okay. 
<laughs> they were just like recover no because like literally they have been after i passed out my boss has been like you're gonna die <laughs> and i'm like i promise i can work and he's like no <laughs> and i'm like okay <laughs> we appreciate that and i do appreciate it yes i can definitely send the um the drawing on ko-fi as well you can always have a boss Actually, um, like in the hospital. Like, yeah, I am gonna miss them when they leave. Um, which yeah. I can't believe I'm saying, but I, I'm gonna miss them! Which is wild. So, are you just gonna like stay on for- Oh yeah. I'm sticking around as long as it's a good gig. Cause it's a good gig. Yeah. The pay is too good to leave. And my coworkers are too chill. Yeah. yeah. But I don't know if our new managers, for context, uh, Bakery Workout is changing ownership because my bosses are retiring. Um, which is like good for them. Which is great for them, yeah. I'm sad, I was gonna make it to their, um, they had a party going on last night, but I got stuck at a meeting Ugh. where I had to watch Saving Private Ryan instead of hanging out. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Evil, terrible. I've never watched Saving Private Ryan. It was a lot. It was rough. I just, it was relentless. I was like, okay, okay. You like, it like opens with a shot of an American flag. You're like, okay. Uh, <laughs> I'm just not about the propaganda. Exactly. No problem with not being able to uh, donate. It's all good. Yeah, I'm like floored. We have made, let me check. Uh, erm. Um, let me check. Huh? <laughs> I'm sorry you're feeling anxious. I promise you, nobody here bites. Um, we are just hanging out. We are just chilling. Yeah, January birthdays. Happy belated, Dub. I was thinking about you the other day. I was like, OMG. My personal life exploded that day. <laughs> but I was thinking about you. <laughs> Um, I love cold pizza. I'm a cold pizza enjoyer. You're insane. I'm sorry. I will eat cold pizza. It's like a sandwich, but like, without like the top part. Then it's not a sandwich. But it's like the, the listen. I don't like cold sandwiches. <laughs> well then there's your problem. <laughs> hot food, hot food, hot food. <laughs> um... Wow, yeah, we've made like easily over $200 during this stream, um, which is freaking crazy. If I give you my donation cash because- OMG, it. of course. Will you paint me my werewolf crying? <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. Oh my God, you're a hero. All right, you take it off? <laughs> I don't want to go. I know, this is so fun. Yeah, we don't get to hang out very much. I know. I mean, OMG, everybody having pizza. Shout out to my friend who is in China and we can't visit each other in our home countries. Because it's so sad. <laughs> because I have, I would need to get a visa to visit her and she would need to get a visit, visa to visit me. That's like awful. Both, like that's so much money. <laughs> no, seriously. That sucks. <laughs> Boo. It's just not justifiable for like, you know, like less than a month to have a trip. Absolutely. Absolutely. Which like sucks because it's like friendship. Literally. I'm like, I haven't seen her since Japan. Oh. <laughs> and she can't visit her boyfriend either because he lives in Mexico. Really? Yeah. Oh, so that's suffering. so hard. Yeah. I mean, I think she's eventually going to move out to Japan. She got a job. Oh, Maybe right. She's going to be doing the training over the summer and then move out to Japan. Gotcha. That makes sense. If things go well. But well, I hope that goes well for her. Yeah. Because, like, that's a lot. That's a long distance. Yeah. Her <laughs> that's a long, like, not even, like, the distance. Like, just not being able to see each other. That's brutal. Literally. And he can't, like, and he would also need a visa to go to China. Right. So it's not like he can be like, yeah, I'll like save up some money and go see you for a couple months. It's like, because it's like you would need a visa. 
Yeah, and I mean, like, you can technically do that. Like, getting a tourist visa, I don't think getting a tourist visa to China would be too difficult. Right. Like, now that COVID isn't as much of a thing. For sure. But still hard. It's still hard. Especially, like, when you're, like, you know, you have, like, your own life going on and you have to, like, plan around that. Yeah, literally. It's hard. It's hard. Tough out here. It's so hard out here for real. Distance and is then people evil. are like, my long distance relationship is four hours. And I'm like, you know, you know. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, the stories I've seen. You don't understand. Like, my parents' relationship was like. Yeah. They were married and living in two different countries. Which is I crazy. can't even believe. That's crazy. I was really like, can you guys just please get divorced so things make sense to people? Literally. <laughs> I don't want to explain. <laughs> oh my god. It's like awful, but also it's really It was so funny. Um, oh my god. Just like, hey, by the way. Well, like, our other friend thought that, like, my dad wasn't around or something, and I was, like, making this up. <laughs> funny. That's funny. <laughs> He was like, no, you don't really talk about your dad. And then when I asked you about it, you said he lives in Brazil. This feels fake. This feels <laughs> fake? <laughs> like, Bro I said you're faking you your dad. Out. Not beating the, uh, what? They were like, at like a co I think they thought it was like a coping mechanism or something. Just like making up some guy in Brazil being like, yeah, okay, I'm going to cut this out because I didn't like the background, but I'm going to put it on something else. Trust the process. My dear Sharky, trust the process. I'm not giving up on you. Yeah. The purple is competing with it. And that's making me sad. I'll include you guys in the process because I like cutting things out. My most insane trait is like hand cutting out all of my stickers. Also, my computer died, so I can't see the chat right now. And I just remembered that I didn't mention that. So if you're talking to me, I can't tell. <laughs> I'm gonna set up my iPad once I'm done with this and I get some pizza. You're so wild for that. We're just out here. We're just out here. I don't know. That's my <laughs> weird life. Though. And then my parents did get divorced and it made things a lot easier to explain like, to people. Like, made it simpler, man. It really did. Like, people are no longer like, why do your parents live in the opposite sides of the country? It's like, divorce. And they're like, ah. Ah, so the divorce. The divorce. Oh my gosh, bruh. Shout out to the Infinity Train soundtrack because now all the time on, like, because I listen to it when I'm, like, drawing or working sometimes, and sometimes, like, a song will just come on titled, like, Divorce Isn't Fair, and everyone can see I'm listening to it, and I'm like, I'm fine, guys. <laughs> I'm just enjoying music. <laughs> I'm not trying to make a statement. <laughs> Your emotional state is not. It is not dependent, nor am I making a statement about my feelings on divorce as a topic. <laughs> oh my god. I feel god. like divorce is definitely better than having parents who are like in an unhappy marriage with each other. Oh, for sure. Absolutely. <laughs> Which like right wing nut jobs can't seem to understand. No, for real. Well, because it's like people, it's like, I don't know, in my fun fact of the world that I grew up in, it was like, well, it's a, it's a pact. It's a, the, what, what did you call it? To Not a pact. Um, uh, I forget the word. Bond? Not bond. Um, it's um, not sacrament. Um, 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 Yes, it's um, what's it called? That's gonna drive me crazy. It means pact, basically. So you can't break it. You just have to fix it. All right, here we go. Here's the little covenant? guy for shark. Covenant. Yes. What's up with like Protestants loving the word covenant? They love the word covenant. Okay, I will be right back. I'm going to grab some pizza and see my friend out.
Okay, we're back. We still got, oh, we got people here still. Let's go. Forgot that I have bird paintings everywhere. Okay. Oh, how we doing? All right, let me move these things. Uh, Sheepy has gone home. She's got a long drive home. I really appreciated her coming out for this. It was really, really sweet of her. Um, let's get back to doing some art. Let me pull up this thing. Let me pull up the chat so I can actually see you guys talking. Hello, welcome back to me. I just realized I welcomed you guys back. Yeah, I saw people mourning. I'm back from the dead. You know how it goes. Um, which one? Oh my god, there's so many of them. Okay, where is it? Where's the one that I need? Mm. Where's the chat? Okay, well, yeah, the soup did save me. Thanks, guys. All right, just kidding. I'm going to unplug my phone for a little bit and see if we can. Let me take a look. Um, um. Nope, not that one. I just like, like why? Like why are there this many <laughs> is the thing. <laughs> like what, <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> I like how I personally can't access my own stream. That's really cool. All right, let's look, let's look, let's look. Googling myself. Stop out here. Oh my god. Excuse me. Okay. Okay, we're back. I think. No, that's the wrong one. Where is it? I'm so confused. We are live. And yet, okay, whatever. Um, I'm just gonna borrow the charger and see how it goes. My enemy, my enemy in the world is um, the streaming platform. Not that, not this, not this, not this. Okay, I'm moving this over here so I don't burn myself. And I'm moving my Osprey because he's in the way. And we're plugging the laptop in so we can talk. Okay, we're back. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you, Peeper. I didn't even think about asking for a link. I'm goofy. I'm goofy in the head. I was like, no, surely no one can provide me with the information. <laughs> Necromancy soup. Interesting. There we go. It's working. Okay. Sweet. In that case, I'm stealing this. Okay. All right, sweet. I'm not sure what's going on. What's happening with the soup? Okay. And we're b -b back. <laughs> you are now out of my sleeve. Okay. So let's go ahead and pull up the next thing. Who is next? Sorry, I'm getting like settled back in. I just ran upstairs to like walk my buddy out. Let's see here. Um, 
we just finished that one and so now we are on to the Chinese dragon and then we have Oliver and Izzy <laughs> all right cool 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 I'm gonna make a note on here so we have Vegeta dragon Oliver Izzy okay cool I have my little to-do list <laughs> we're back in business baby all right cool let's get back I kind of forgot to eat so I'm glad that Chibi forced me to eat a pizza pizza because I was just like sitting here like Whoa. all right I'm gonna look up a reference image so I don't screw this up mm, let's do this one Oh yeah, I keep making the blues clue sound all the time. One of my friends does that little like vocal stim and then it just like took over my brain as well. All right. So how we doing? I'm glad people survived the intermission. What if soup but like gushers? Please explain. Oh, you nuked your Twitter? Yeah, I haven't been on Twitter since Elon Musk bought it. <laughs> I kind of miss it sometimes, but um... Matt Pat, yo, OMG, Vegeta, I'm drawing your dragon right now. Welcome back. Aw, oh, thank you, Fireflies. You are at the top of my list. Matt Pat's leaving, bro. For a second there, I was like, I, I, I had like a very delusional moment where I was like, wow. I was, I was like, MatPat in my chat and he's leaving? That's so sad. Bye, MatPat. Girl? No. <laughs> MatPat's not in my chat. Does he want to be? Can he make seal deer lore? Seal deer explained. Welcome back, Copper. Thanks for being here. Seal Deer ARG, Seal Deer, Seal Deer, hello, Seal Deer Iceberg Explained. That's crazy. I've never watched a MatPat video. This is, um, yeah, this is a new sketchbook. Yeah, I know. I literally haven't. I've never watched MatPat. Like, ever. <laughs> I just haven't done it. So I, um, I kind of missed that wave. Bye, Moosh. You take care. Yeah. Five nights at Sealed Ears! It's true. Is he gonna like take his videos down? Should I like, should I be on this before it becomes lost media? He's the, he's, I'm sorry, this is a dumb question, but like, is this like a, is he, he's the game theory guy, right? Getting roasted in chat for not knowing that that <laughs> all right the dragon is coming along you're named after Matt Pat and I love that for you. I am also Year of the Dragon. I think. No, wait. No, I'm Year of the, the... Why did I say that? I don't actually know if I am. I'd have to check. 
yeah um i actually am matt pat i'm deleting my other channel so i can focus on this one just so you guys know i mean you could probably tell by the voice it's just a theory a seal theory Oh my god, you're Matt Pat's mom? That's really cool. Congratulations, you must be so proud of your son. Yeah, I mean, not gonna lie, guys. Took you long enough to figure it out, but like, I mean, hey. I kept up, I kept up like my brand like pretty differently, so that makes sense. Wait, who was the one who met the Pope? Who was the, who was the, who was the, 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 Oh, sweet. Okay, I'm Year of the Dragon. It's my year, guys. <laughs> Seal Dear Afton, yes. <laughs> Wait, Matt Pat was the one who met the Pope? Okay, yeah, I was gonna say, I was like, no, Toby Fox did not meet the Pope, but I kept thinking Undertale. Okay, that makes me so free. It's so funny. I love that that happened. I love that that happened. I love that that happened. Like, I think about it and I'm like, wow, thank God. <laughs> Truly one of the moments ever. <laughs> yeah, um, Matt Pat met the Pope and gave gave the Pope a copy of Undertale, um, which I think is quite beautiful. One of my very favorite games, as most people know. I never was like really into like the fan base, but like I really I really enjoyed the games. I really liked Deltarune a lot too. The FNAF movie was so silly. I had a great time. Shout out to Josh Hutcherson. <laughs> I love to paint with warm colors. They're my favorite. Oh, thank you, Rue. Much appreciated. Agreed. Abby was great. Oh my god, I'm so glad you like them. It's a fun request. I'm having a good time with it. I love like a really noodly dragon. The Sans battle theme? I'm sorry, I'm lost. Wait, what played the Sands battle theme? Ooh. All right, see ya, Pigeon. Thank you for hanging out. <gasps> Much appreciated. It has been a night. So true. It's always, ca this is why I don't stream that often, because like my, I don't have good tech. Like, the phone that I am currently recording on, I bought refurbished, and it was already old. Like, it was already outdated when I bought it. Um, and I've repaired this exact phone, like, over seven times. So it's not built for streaming, let alone streaming with a bad app. Um, which is why I don't stream very often. Just because this always happens. a few classics but not I'm not super super duper well read and I will freely admit that I would also love to learn how to sew my grandma also does that oh I don't know Ava that sounds right <laughs> see I love reading um I just I mostly read for school right now. I have seen Across the Spider-Verse. I love all of the Spider-Verse movies. I think they're awesome. I 
I love how they really changed the game in animation. And, like, you can kind of see the ripples in a lot of other, like, properties where it's, like, people are getting way more experimental with it. It makes me so happy. Like, they really set an awesome trend with Spider-Verse. Sorry, my iPad screen keeps dimming and it's making me mad. I'm going to fix that really quick. Um, ba -ba 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 Where is my settings? I'm not an iOS girly. Um... Battery saver, stop taking my screen away from me. Okay. There we go. The Pope did listen to Neglavania. That's so beautiful. <laughs> I'm sure that changed his life and everyone's lives for the better. I really enjoy, oh, I loved Fiona and Cake. Oh, I mean, if you post fan art anywhere, like I have a Tumblr, I have an Instagram and you tag me, I'll be able to see it. Or you could email it to me at, um, what's my email? Sealdeerofficial at gmail.com. Somebody took the email um, sealedeer at gmail.com, <laughs> which I'm like, who are you? <laughs> I see you. <laughs> All right. For our beloved Vegeta, we have a Chinese style dragon. Hey, welcome back, Brent. Aw, thank you. I appreciate it. I always love seeing fan art. It's really sweet. Aw, thank you so much. I love you, peeper. Mwah. Oh, wow, thank you so much. Let me know in the chat what you'd like me to draw. For I? I think it's an I or is that an L? All right, there is the dragon. I'm so breakfast core. Slay. Oh, thank you, Blue. Bro, I did my paintbrush in all the wrong things all the time. I literally got, I brought down like a covered thermos for this endeavor because I knew I was gonna put my paintbrush in my coffee if I used a mug today because I'm doing the stream. <laughs> Aw, thank you, Brick Oven. Yeah, I'm gonna send them on Ko-Fi as well. Thank you. Um, I just have like a normal, it's a coffee with like hazelnut creamer. I'm a hazelnut girly. I love, hazelnut coffee is my favorite flavor of coffee, hands down, forever. Recognition of the self. <laughs> All right, um, let me get back on Ko-Fi. Our next is Oliver. Ooh, we're talking music. Yeah. Um, let me check it out. Um, favorite dog breed? I don't think I have a favorite, honestly. Like, I don't know. I just like dogs. I like cats too. I'm not like I'm not like either or. Oh my god, Dub! I just saw the I just saw the message you put on yours. You are so sweet. <laughs> A drawing of your dog, aw. 
Oh, <laughs> your dog is really cute. It's so funny, someone just asked about dogs. <laughs> I have heard that song, yes. I liked Cave Town a lot when I was in high school. I don't really listen to them anymore though, but I'm I'm not anti Cave Town at all. I love the white stripes. Fell in love with the girl is like one of my favorite songs. It's so like crunchy in such a good way. Oh, a lamb. Yeah, of course. Thank you so much again. Yeah, I love, I love MCR. I love, um, I really like Alice Phoebe Lou, um, and I really like, in a similar vein, Laura Stevenson. They both do, like, really, like, dreamy kind of music, and, like, they have crazy vocals. I don't, Worm Food? Question mark? Is that song? I, I don't think I've heard that. cute dog. Oh, it's an album. I see, I see. Uh, I work at, I'm like a barista, basically. I work at a bakery. I make lattes and I make salads. <laughs> and I do everything else that needs to be done, basically. We're like, I feel like, okay, so at my work, it's like the bakers are like, the shy and like talented creatures who were like i feel like us in the front are like the hardened grunts who are there to protect them like the bakers will come up with our stock and be like i'm sorry i'm sorry nobody look at me i'm so sorry and we'll be like i got you baby girl don't even worry about it if anybody looks at them i will kill them because we deal with the public all the time <laughs> oh yeah i liked the new Mo mountain goats album actually i know it wasn't very like popular overall with people but like I really like um, Mark On You, uh, and I really like the other one, um, Training Montage. I'm so jealous. I want to see them live so bad. No, we are. We are the no pickles people with the bakers. Because, like, I have seen some stuff, man. The public gets nasty about wanting their bread. I'm immune. <laughs> I can handle it, but the bakers, they show up and they're like, guys, I can't do it. I'm so sorry. I don't, I'm, I'm not in my element. <laughs> and every time we're all like, no, dude, you're good. You're perfect. You've done nothing wrong in your entire life. It's a great dynamic. I, I like the job. It's a good job. It's a good gig. I am not going to do a face reveal. Um, that is up to your imagination. Um, I haven't really been to a lot of concerts recently. I think the most recent one was with Lil. We went to go see the Beths. Yes, local bakeries all the way. Plus like Starbucks is kinda, I don't know, they can be pretty bad to their employees overall. I'm a seal deer, exactly. Yeah, I can draw myself right now. Um, that's me. <laughs> Peeper. <laughs> Yes, they do. I know there's an organic boycott going around Starbucks right now. Same with McDonald's. Ooh. 
Ooh, cafe blue. Ah, it's too dark, it's too dark. My dream pet. Ooh, I don't know. Um, I would really like to have a bird someday, I think. I think that'd be really fun. Like a pigeon or something, or like, um, I don't know, I love, my family has chickens, which I, I so I guess I do have birds. Um, but yeah, I, I love birds. More bird interaction in my life is always a plus. <laughs> you wanna see up there? A stellar bird, Grandpa. That's all I want to be in my life, dude. The Blue Mountain. Cafe Blue Up in the Mountains. That's so nice. The pictures you've sent of where you live are insane. A raccoon named Oat Milk. Wow. Follow your dreams, bud. I was gonna say like, how does that work? Yes, it is 9.10. Bro, we've been going for four hours, that's crazy. Yes, please, I want more pictures. I love watercolors. I mean, I don't know, I don't know your style of art or like what you like using, but if you like them, use them. Oh yeah, I've seen, um, I've actually seen the crow that Edgar Allan Poe used to have. They have it taxidermied in a library archive. <laughs> grip, grip the, grip the, the crow. <laughs> It was, um, what's his faces? It was, it didn't belong to Edgar Allan Poe, but it was the reason he wrote it. It belonged to another writer. Lil. Lil what? Who owned the crow? The, the raven. The, 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 the raven at the library. Was it Charles? Hold on. I, think, I feel like it was, hold on. Okay, I was right, it was Charles Dickens. Okay, cool. Slay. All right, here is the dog. Thank you so much again to Ollie. And we are going down to Izzy. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Thank you, yes. You were right, Peeper. Yeah, here's, um, hold on. Gah. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Please. Please god. Please work. Check it out. Grip the raven. <laughs> Just hanging out. Um All right. Now we are on to stinky brain disease. Uh Hold on. Let me make sure that's actually the one that's next in the chat. I'm pretty, yeah, it's, it's Izzy. Okay. Izzy time. Don't be sorry, we're still hanging out. Um, I don't know when I'm gonna do another stream. Um, I don't stream very often just because I always have technical difficulties and it's like, <laughs> it's kind of a mess every time, but um, I know people really like them. So 
I don't know. I, I've kind of toyed around with the idea of like doing like a monthly stream or something because um, I think that'd be more manageable for me. Just like, okay, I can plan ahead, figure out what I want to do. Um, but I don't know. That's not a promise. That's a concept in my brain. All right, how do I get to my donations? Here we go. I love Ko-Fi. Ko-Fi is so, so nice for like, I feel like it's just, it's so user-friendly in a way that's like really important. All right, Izzy time. Well, that's, that's not a bad question. Um, So an eSIM is, it just basically allows you to activate your phone and access data, um, which is really important because like basically all the networks are completely down in Gaza and in Palestine. So by having a, like, a virtual eSIM, we can buy people an eSIM so they can connect to um, other people and connect to like resources they need to talk to their families. Because like, I can't imagine being in that scenario and like not having a phone. Um, so it's really important uh, to be able to see that. And then I stopped posting, well, I still post on like my Tumblr and my other accounts, but um, a, a bunny with a strawberry, that's really cute. Let me start drawing. But um, I don't post on YouTube super often just because, well, last semester I was really busy and then I started having health problems. Uh, so I haven't really had the time or energy to do videos just because my body was freaking out, but it seems to be getting better, so that's good. This is giving shallot. This is our snack. Do I have any happy, happy Clover fans in the chat tonight? Please say yes. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, I'm not like sick or anything. It was just like weird body stuff. My, my body's weird. I've got nervous system problems. <laughs> So that was very annoying. It kind of put a wrench in my plans, but that's how it goes. Oh, no, no, it's not. I wouldn't talk about it if I was uncomfortable. You are all good. I have no, no qualms shutting down questions I don't want to answer. <laughs> He's a little guy. He's got a little strawberry. You already know. Um, hold on, let me. Make sure that's the right color. Um, I really like using like bits of paper to decorate my sketchbook with, like just like pieces of stuff that I find around. I think it's really fun. Little guy. I love bunnies. Bunnies are such a favorite of mine. Aw, Peter Rabbit! Um, so crayons don't blend like watercolors, but if you use them lightly, you can get a lot of variation, I feel like, and you kind of layer them in a similar way. I'm just using Crayola. Oh, wait, here's the brown. LOL. I love the crunchy effect that Crayola markers give. I'm so there. Thank you, Parker. Much appreciated. Crayola on top. <laughs> the Crayola fans have arrived.
this is not Crayola. This is a fancier crayon right here. This peachy one. FYI. It's not the paint water. Don't drink paint water. It's not good for your health. <gasps> Parker! That's my boy! I love you, Parker. I'm so glad you're here. <laughs> my dear friend Parker is here. I'm so glad you're here. Oh my god. <laughs> Seal's getting pretentious. <laughs> Cancelled. Seal Deer uses a non-cheap art supply. One million years dungeon. It's literally Parker time. It's literally Parker time. You already know it's Parker time. PP Parker is here. See ya, Ava. Aw, no problem, Parker. It's just great to see you. Please do not stay up super late for this. It will be it will be archived. You need rest. <laughs> Aw, bye, Ava. You take care. Spider Man. <laughs> Oh yeah, my crayons always break. I push way too hard when I use them. It's like, it's a really bad habit, but I can't break it. <laughs> it's 9.20 for me right now. I really like this Crushed Spider-Verse. I thought it was devastating. Um, emotionally gutting, very beautiful. It hurt so bad. <laughs> it's 4 a.m. for you. <laughs> Lord. Yo, you're making an AMV? I respect you. I respect you. We have 17 in the queue. We could probably cut them off pretty soon then. I mean, I can always do more after the stream. All right, Bunny is done. S okay, Styx DM'd me. I didn't know what he was saying. <laughs> oh my God, and then your next Wyatt after that. I'm gonna message him. And then after that, while I wait for that, I'm gonna start on the one after. So we had... Um, let me look. Who is after sticks? Okay, wait, they got back to me. A shark. Bow, 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 bow. Okay, and then we have Frosty. And then Dinky, Evie, Lucy ish. Okay. I did eat some pizza. It was quite good. <laughs> I don't know what a hammerhead chart looks like. Hold on, I need to look something up. Hammer, ah, hammerhead, hammerhead shark. Yeah, no, I'm always very impressed with the people ch like chilling in the chat. People are really nice. 
AMV watchers. Let's go. Oh my god, there's still a hundred of you? Lord. <laughs> I don't want to draw him from memory. <laughs> I don't want to do it. Oh, I don't want to do it. All right, um... Here he is. Sorry, I got really focused on this because I haven't drawn a shark in a really long time. I forgot that I was streaming. I forgot <laughs> that I was live and people can see me. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm gonna do crayon again. He requested a shit posty shark, so this is me doing that. Wait, help, you're right. <laughs> I just reenacted a germa clip. <laughs> Dude, I'm becoming germa. What do I do? 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 How do I stop it? How do I undo that? <laughs> that was not intentional. <laughs> I literally swear on my life. I just, I did, I forgot that I was streaming. <laughs> I didn't know her. <laughs> Google search, how do I not become Germo? Please, 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 please. I'm gonna wake up in a dollhouse, bro. I... <laughs> Germo dear. Dear God. I don't really know how to explain what Germa is. Um, I feel like every time I try to explain Germa, I just like don't do it right. I like, I couldn't tell you. He's just like a guy. Like he's just a dude, but he's just like fascinating. Like I want to study him. Germa's so baby girl. <laughs> Help. When will Germa collab with me? That's what I want to know. <laughs> when will Jerma come on my channel? <laughs> All right, there's the uh, there's the there's the shit posty shark. Um, I, I feel like I should do more detail, but I kind of like this as it is. I'm gonna add some sparkles. Yeah. 
Yeah, let me get Jerma's number up real quick. I'm gonna call him right now. Jeremy. Jeremy, come on. Come here. Psst, 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 psst. Okay. And then next we have. Um, who is next? <gasps> it's Squirrelbird! It is the SEPTA 1982 Kowalski K-Type trolley car. You already know. <laughs> Alright, hold on, let me Google this. Let me Google this. Let me Google this. Let me Google this. Yeah, I'm Matt Pat and Jerma. I'm both of them. I'm literally both of them. This is for my trolley pilled, my trolley pilled based based transport. Drace Pan Transport King. All right. Um. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. That helps because my thing was not pasting. Oh, this is sick. This rules. Okay, let me go split view with YouTube again. Oh wow, thank you so much, Vivi. Wow, this is awesome. This is so real. All right, I'm turning it this way. Trust the process, guys. I'm really focused on this. I'm really focused on this. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. My favorite OC, the SEPTA. Let me get the logo on here. Sept. Okay, and then we got like the, the little thingy up here. The... These are the doors. These are the doors. <laughs> Trolley pilled. <laughs> All will be clear. Don't worry. You have to trust the process. You can't rush perfection. She's literally here. She's literally here. All right. Now it's time to like detail this bad boy. Ah, oh, shoot, I used the water-based one. I guess I could kind of work to my advantage, hold on. She's here. <laughs> the trolley. All right. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Let's see. I'm gonna use my paint markers for this, I think. All right. Let's see. Let's see what we can do here. 
I really do feel like a SEPTA 1982 Kowalski K-type trolley car. Honest to God. Okay, I am going to pull up a different picture. Bam. Okay, there we go. I needed the pictures. I mean the colors. I oh, needed the colors. As much as I dig like the crazy Christmas lights on this picture, I need to get like the Oh, see you, Kibby. Yo, is Shib here? Is Shib here or are we just saying Shib? I do not watch those shows. Oh, see, but I kind of want to draw it at night because I like how they look like when they're like glowy on the inside, even though it's going to be harder. Let's see. Do I have a picture? Eh, I can make it work. Maybe? I don't know if I can. Am I strong enough for this? In my heart, we are all sitting inside of a SEPTA trolley right now. up as I go. Oh, bye Sharky. Thank you so much for donating. Oh wait, I should have used that on here. Guys, I'm scared. Guys, I'm scared. Guys, I'm scared. Guys, I'm scared. I don't think I'm either a dog or a cat person. I like them both. I think I'm more of like a cat owner but like I love dogs. She's so beautiful, you're so right. She's gorgeous. just because I don't think I have the right colors to color match this in a way that's not going to be really, really scuffed. <laughs> All right, let's see. My favorite warrior cat is Yellowfang. Most definitely Yellowfang. Do, 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 do. I, we should probably stop doing donuts, huh? Just because I don't want to like over, over promise what I can do tonight. Um, I would love to like 
I'll definitely, what's the word I'm looking for? Um, make sure that everybody gets theirs. Yeah, let me, girl, I don't think I can remove the overlay without it doing the thing again. <laughs> I'm gonna be so honest. If you guys wouldn't mind just like periodically putting in like a, hey, donations are over. That would be awesome. Cause I think it'll break again. And I am not emotionally strong enough to try and fix it again. <laughs> I think, yeah, because I don't want to, like, overpromise what I can finish today and tomorrow. Um, I definitely would like to do another stream pretty soon, though. I think this is a lot of fun. Ooh, hummingbirds or red-winged blackbirds is a tough question. Um, I really like them both. I'm really having a great time with this, um, with this, with this, uh, with this, um, with this trolley. I love animals. Yes. <laughs> My favorite animal, the trolley. She's so beautiful to me. Yo, <laughs> let's go. The trolley gang has risen up and I'm so happy to see it. Hello, trolley nation. Um, so I am like an art therapy slash studio art major, but I'm also like, I don't, it's really complicated. I'm in like a humanities program. I'm basically on a scholarship on top of a scholarship so that I don't have to like be broke. Um, so I'm doing a lot of things right now. <laughs> Astrophysics, that's sick. I love physics majors. You guys are so wild. The beautiful animal. She's here. See ya. Yeah, don't let anybody like tell you you have to have it all figured out when you're like 18 and like right when you're out of like high school. Cause like, that's just not true. It really isn't. Like I know so many people who are still figuring it out who are way older than me. Aw, happy to see you too. Thank you so much. Also, I'm so sorry to the person who just spilled water on their art. That sucks. R.I.P. I'm so glad you like her. I'm gonna shade just a little bit. Sorry about the scratchy noises. All right, I think that's, that is a solid trolley. <laughs> She's here. Hold on, let me do some sparkles. For dramatic effect. ASMR was sealed. <laughs> All right, 
that's a trolley that's a trolley <laughs> thank you so much that was genuinely such a fun request <laughs> all right let's see i love hearing that when people are like um thank you guys for promoting the like donations are over thing because i again i don't want to over oh my gosh awesome awesome the joy in my heart edible trolley <laughs> let's go i mean if you if you bit hard enough All right, let's take a look. Let's see who's next on the docket. Frosty, all right. Frosty, what did you request? All right. Oh, I don't think there's a request on here. So... I'm gonna move on to the next one and I'm gonna message them after the fact. Unless Frosty, you're here in chat. In which case, please let me know what you would like. Dinky's next. Oh, there's no description there either. Um, okay, I'm gonna message them and they'll. I will send this to them separately. Pow, 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 pow. <laughs> Frosty, call for Frosty. <laughs> Please, bestie, do you want art? All right, Romine shop. Do, 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 do. Dinky, call for Dinky. Ooh, okay, here we go. Oh, cute art, cute art, cute art. Wow, this person has really cute art. See you, doodles. All right, let me um, let me curb some of this chaos really quick before we keep going. I also think that I'm going to change my paper here since it's a little bit crazy. So we're just gonna move these over here. My poor paint water is like nasty right now. Oh, I'm glad this is helping with your art vlog. Okay, there we go. My goop water. I don't want to talk about my goop water. My nasty, nasty goop water. And yes, donations are, at least art requests are over like for tonight. The noxious goo. <laughs> All right, let's see. Oh, these are really cute characters. Okay. Um. Your seaweed. Oh, I wish I had seaweed right now. I love seaweed. That's a cute idea. Yeah, I will be. Um, it's a. Uh, where is it? It's over here. Oh, oops! I kicked the pizza box. My bad. It's like very, very close to being done. She's like almost there. We're like very close. It's really heavy. <laughs> I'm very excited. Oh, thank you, Mary. Luther King, the sequel. <laughs> yeah, no, this thing is crazy. 
This is, um, I wear this to my painting class. Believe it or not, this is after it's been washed many times. It's just like, it's like catastrophic. It's crunchy. Um, I don't really have a date for my next video, uh, just because of everything getting kind of thrown off by all my health garbage, but I don't know is the best answer I have. Hopefully sooner rather than later, but I don't want to like put a date out and then realize I can't make it. Dude, fish stew, yes. Oh my god, the fish stew was insane. Things that I think about. Good night, Copper. Thank you so much for hanging out and for donating. It's very, very appreciated. Oh, uh, do I have the right colors for this? I'm gonna have to use a marker, huh? Let's look. Oh, my favorite character that I have. It's so hard. Um, I don't think I could pick a favorite off the top of my head, but I really like writing my character, Resley. Um, he's like one of the unicorns. He's the really pointy one. Um, <laughs> that wasn't an answer. But you know how it goes. He's like, he looks like this. I'll draw him. This is Razzly. I have the most fun writing him, I think, because he's just like really done with everything. This is Razzly. He's my BFF. <laughs> funny. That's funny. I really want to make like um like a website. Like I don't know, like a, like I really I've wanted a Neo Cities website for like a really long time. Um and so I would really like to make a Neo Cities website where I update my like little story comic things. He does not play the clarinet. He does not play any instruments. He's not a musician. You pet isopods? It's sick. I am surprised there are so many of you sticking this out. That is crazy. <laughs> it is like, it has been a long stream. 
and everyone's been really cool. I'm genuinely really happy. I wasn't sure if we were gonna get some weird stuff in the chat. This is somebody else's character. Um, it was from someone who goes by Ramine Expo. Literally, you guys are wild. I thought we were gonna be like fizzling out by like a solid 8 p.m. Earth, so true. I love Earth, all my guys are here. That's crazy. <laughs> Throughout like all of the nonsense that happened, that's crazy. I love drawing in a more anime style. It's so fun. It takes me back to my roots, like my how to draw manga roots. And I love it. <laughs> it's the best. Let me break out this bad boy. So true, peepers. Paint water tastes nasty. It tastes bitter and gross and bad. I know because it happens to me, man. It's not cool. It sucks. Well, no. Hey guys. Hey now. Hey. Hey, don't, don't, do not sip your paint water. That's got chemicals in it, dude. So bring me back to my like teaching art elementary schoolers days. <laughs> I'm over that. <laughs> Not a very good mukbang. <laughs> Y'all are getting brain damage in my chat. Paint water brain damage. <laughs> Unbelievable. Seven years, so true. And I will make them keep that promise. If you drink paint water in my chat, I will see you in 20, what? 2031. 20, <laughs> No way. <laughs> no way. Oh my god. I'm so glad you like it. I really like your character. You have a really, really cute art style.
what is happening? Why are we fighting in here? <laughs> what is the discourse? Are we fighting about bugs? I'm pro bug, dude. I love bugs. I think they're neat. I don't think I really have a favorite hairstyle to draw, honestly. I like drawing like really fluffy hair, I feel like. Like she deserved to like be like floating in the clouds. Oh, I love hognose snakes. Alrighty, we are moving on to the next one. Thank you again so much, Yamine, for your donation. Oh yeah, I've definitely wrecked some art and art supplies on accident many, many times. All right, we are almost there. We are on to number 22. And that is Shiny Ray's profile picture. One of my pen is dying. It's okay, I have more. And Bam. I think I'm gonna use markers for this one. Good night, Mary. Oh, I love my little pony. My other paint water cup. Check this out. Check it out, guys. I'm gonna pour paint water on accident. We got the whole gang. And the giant wall of text, too. It's good stuff. It's good stuff. I'm gonna move the flowers so you guys can see them. Check that out. You get flowers. Yeah, it's been a, it's been a long stream, but I'm gonna keep going. I'm gonna keep going. Yeah, of course. Thank you for asking.
My favorite pony. Oh, that's really hard. Um, that's really hard. So I'm definitely Twilight coded. I feel like if I was a pony, I would be Twilight. Um, because of the way that I am. But a my favorite pony is so hard. I really like Rarity. Um. I really like Rarity a lot. <laughs> when I was watching it as a kid, my favorite was Scootaloo. Um, Applejack is awesome. Applejack is underrated. I love Applejack. I don't know. They all—they're all so great. Pinky, uh, Pinky, and um, Scootaloo were my favorites growing up for sure. But Rarity's really grown on me. Okay, there's that one for Shiny Ray. And now we're doing a Jackalope for Esser. And then next, I'm gonna do another thing. So we have Esther's Jackalope. And then we have Alex, Dear Cowboy. And then we have Moth Soup and Miff Maple and then Dub. Okay, and there's more after that. I just am gonna do those for now. I don't know what the infection thing means. I'm gonna be so honest. <gasps> good night, Wyatt. It was so good to have you here. All right, Jackalope time. I don't like that one yet. Hold on. I, I drew it like, I drew it to, to my little pony E because I think about ponies. Oh, thank you, duck. Of course. Why, I can mail that to you if you want. If you would like to have the physical copy. TikTok, I see, I understand. I understand now. Yeah, there were a lot of like really violent My Little Pony videos going around when I was a kid, um, that was crazy. I watched like 30 seconds of one and I thought about it for like years. Um, I have, uh, I've, I won an illustration contest. I, I had a really small college with an even smaller art department. So it's not like I, you know, swept a whole art school, but I did get, um, an award for an illustration that I put in at my college art show, which was really fun. This, I don't, it's not, I, I wouldn't recommend it. <laughs> Um, they're, they kind of smudge a lot. I don't, it came in a giant set and I bought them in Belgium. Aw, thank you for the tip. I really appreciate that. That's really sweet of you. Aw. 
That made my heart very happy. Unbelievable, Lil. Blocked. <laughs> no, no, no. I meant that you aren't allowed to take bathroom breaks. Um, this is, this is, uh, this, this is, this is, um... What's the opposite of a union? <laughs> yeah, please don't feel like you need to stay up and like wait out the whole stream, especially if it's really late for you or if you're tired. Okay. Capitalism unbridled. <laughs> so true. Yeah, this is um this is this is capitalism. Trust the process, guys. I'm going to go over this again. Um I haven't seen Hamilton. I listened to it in high school though. Got to let this dry cuz then I'm going to go over it. Do you see my vision? <laughs> I'm not dope, but I love more. So true. All right, see you, Jen. Um, I don't have a favorite sketchbook brand. I just like whatever. Hold on, I'm gonna open up my little snack. My little snack. My little bowl of seeds. Yeah, I did that on purpose. I'm going to let it dry and then I'm going to go over it because I wanted to change the line art a little bit and I like the crazy look. I'm going to mute myself because I'm going to eat an almond or two and it's going to be crunchy. Okay, I'm back. I had an almond. It was great. <laughs> Thank you all for your concern. <laughs> we want to hear the crunch. <laughs> to wait for this to dry a little bit more to finish detailing that but I'm really happy with him <laughs> it happens sometimes it lags oh thanks daydreaming I appreciate that um I wear whatever I'm currently wearing a shirt that says kindergarten rocks um and I've got these crazy earrings on let me show you I've got these guys on right now which I think are very fun they're very sparkly. My aunt got them for me for my birthday. Um, I really like <clears throat> like a skirt and a sweater combo. It's kind of my vibe right now. 
in like a chunky boot. I get all my clothes from the thrift store, so I don't really have a brand. Just buy whatever's cheap. Ooh, roasted watermelon seeds. That sounds yummy. I would try that. Okay. The jackalope is done. OMG, welcome back, Lil. I love pumpkin seeds. Okay, now we're on to Deer Cowboy. I don't know if... Is Alex still here? I think Alex left. Did you leave, Alex? Are you here? Um, I was like, did they mean like a, a deer who is a cowboy? Oh, I do know what a vaquita is. I love those things. The really, really endangered like porpoises. Oh, you're here. Okay, Alex, did you want a deer that is a cowboy or a cowboy who has like a deer as a stallion? Okay, perfect. That's what I thought. Okay, I'm looking. I never know how to draw a cowboy hat off the top of my head. I feel like it's embarrassing. I, I gotta fix that. Uh, cowboy hat. I love Brie, Honey, and anything. Just Brie is amazing. Oh, thank you so much. Scrumptious. Ooh, fun sticker on it. What color? I like yellow. Unsurprisingly, I also love a green. I love a fun, like, like a pretty, like, green color. I feel like those are really nice. Those make me happy. If I'm looking at something a lot, I like it when it's a pretty green color. My Palestine bracelet keeps coming off, and it needs to be here for the vibe. Hi, Bambi. Thank you so much for being here. Something else that's very cowboy y. I am not an ice cream soup kind of person. I like my ice cream to be cold. I do love a milkshake though, but I get kind of icked out when it's just like melted ice cream. Personal preference. Like I don't mind it. But 
but I would prefer my ice cream to be like not melty. Um, this is like, it's just, I've just kind of been doodling in it. I'm probably gonna make it crazy like my other ones eventually, but right now it's just kind of like for fun. I'm giving him a knife. I feel like he needs to look a little bit threatening. Popsicle vibes. Oh, like stirred up. I see, I see, I see, I see. Yogurt vibes, I see that. Okay, I feel like the, the leg is gonna go like. There he is in all of his dear cowboy glory. Ooh, ice cream gelato or frozen yogurt? Aw, of course, see ya, Esther. Thanks for stopping by and hanging out so long. Dear Cowboy. <laughs> He's so cowboy -y. Oh, I love guac. I'm so glad we like Cowboy Deer. I'm having a really good time with him. Oh, this paper sucks. It's got the goop. There's fuzz. There we go. I'm trying to think of like a good like cowboy deer pun. But like not a bad one, like a good one. Oh man, I love tea. Ginger, yes, I love ginger. Ginger tea is so good. broke back I was tr I was trying to think I was like man like but I couldn't think of anything because I haven't seen it <laughs> because it will kill me oh shoot whoops Oh, I love mochi. Mochi's so good.
would taste like such a comfort food. Mango mochi is my favorite. I just like mango anything. Mango is my favorite flavor. I feel like cowboy deer um, just goes onto all fours and starts sprinting instead of riding another animal. This suburbia ain't big enough for the both of us, girl. <laughs> it, it did make me laugh, so. <laughs> Alex, you understand. Oh, me boy. I think my cat's here. Hold on. Do you want to come say hi? That's not yours. What do you think? What do you think? What? What's going on? <laughs> What's going on? This is Mabel, for those who are wondering. What do you think, huh? She's sniffing so hard. She wants the pizza so bad. <laughs> what? All right, all right, let me, uh, let's get back over here. Look at how crazy this got. I'm wearing my shoes because I'm in the basement and it's really cold. I'm not a monster. I keep these down here because then my toes will freeze. Anyways, that's my baby girl. I'm glad people enjoy her. Aw, oh, thank you. Yeah, please, please, please get some sleep. If you were staying up really late. Thank you guys for being here. I really appreciate it. Hi. What are you doing? Oh my god, she's being really cute. What are you doing, kitty? Hi. Come here. Come here. You can go around the box. 
I promise. Come here. <gasps> Baby. She's here. <laughs> hi, kitty. You saying hi? Are you saying hi? <laughs> what? What's going on? She's thinking about it so hard. You gonna come up? You gonna come up? You just gonna sit there. Okay, we're gonna rub our teeth on some wires. Donate to Palestine for more Mabel content. This. This. Mabel wants genocide to end. Mabel is anti-apartheid. She told me. <laughs> my favorite art piece that I've ever made is a hard question to answer. I'm really happy with my Osprey. I showed it to people who were on the stream earlier, but I'm really happy with this one right now. Um, just because I really like Ospreys. Okay. Back to the cowboy deer. Aw, oh, thank you. I've been really into painting lately. It's literally bird time, you already know. I'm so excited, tomorrow morning, I'm gonna go feed the birds. Like, with, like they're having a birding event at a park near me where we're gonna learn about the winter migratory birds and then we're gonna get to feed our birds with our hands. They're gonna come play in our hands and I'm so excited. I get crazy dreams all the time. I have weird dreams. It's like been the only thing keeping me going this entire week has been like, I'm gonna go see the birds and I'm gonna go feed them and everything's gonna be okay. That and the stream, I've been very excited for the stream. I love peacocks. They're very beautiful to me. What are you doing, Mabel? What are you doing? She's really sad that she can't have pizza. Girl, I made you scrambled eggs. And you treat me this way. I'm glad that we have some bird enjoyers in the chat. What, kitty? What are you doing? She's sniffing crazy style. Welcome back. Yeah, peacocks are crazy. I look at them and I'm like, you're not a real animal. Like, how did you do that? <laughs> Favorite show? Right now it's Scavenger's Reign, without a doubt. I love, 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 love Scavenger's Reign. It's really gory and it's very intense and very like kind of gut-wrenching, but it's also so beautiful. It's like one of the prettiest shows I've ever seen in my entire life. Please watch Scavenger's Reign. If you are not like a very young child. I think it would be a little bit traumatizing if you're a very young child but I'm not, I'm not a cop. I'm not your mom, so just be smart. Pole dark, never heard of that. Aww. Oh, Thrashers, that's awesome. I really like The Bear also. The Bear is a really good show. As somebody who works in food service, um, <laughs> I love how real it is. <laughs> that is so how it feels. As soon as he was like, heard, I was like, you understand. You understand me. I speak your language, baby girl. What are you talking about, Mabel? I don't know if you guys can hear her. She's got a lot to say. All right, Cowboy Deer is here. Oh my God, yes, we've got a bear fan in the chat. <laughs> I 
I love that show. Alrighty, we are moving on to our next adventure, which is Moth Soup. I'm probably gonna call this off at about 11 p.m. my time, which is in about 30 minutes, just because I have to get up really early to go drive to get to the park that has the birds. Um, and then I'm also doing something that night and I am not a high energy person. <laughs> but we'll see how far I get. Wow, we've been going for over five hours. That's crazy. Thank you very much. Of course, I'm really glad you like it. <gasps> and with an E, are you kidding me? I love that show. I was just thinking about it. That show is insane. Okay, we're on to Moth Soup. Where is Moth Soup? Oh, we also have Sage. I think we missed Sage. Who has a whale shark snacking on a star first. And then, oh my gosh, the Moshi Monsters request is so exciting. Okay. Okay. Um, let's see, a whale shark. YouTube donations also get a uh, drawing. I would love to do some more streams like this. Um, I was really curious to see how it would like go and how it would turn out. Yeah, sorry, I got really distracted. I was very into the um, the whale shark, but I would really like to do more of these streams. I think this was a really, really successful night. My favorite sea animal um, besides seals is probably manta rays. I really like manta rays. I forgot. I forgot it was a person. I forgot. Oh, thank you so. Yes. The silence was too loud. <laughs> Starno's mole, yes! I love a mole. Lil's in her mole era right now. You should definitely talk moles with Lil. Whale shark. Yes, correct. This is a whale shark. Oh, jellyfish are really neat. Um, 
Um, yeah, Peapod Dino. Um, basically, my phone crashed, and then every time I tried to join the stream again, it would just make a new stream, but it would lock me out of each one. Um, and so I had to hard reset my phone and then make a brand new stream. I do not know how I'm going to close all of them. I'm going to be so real. I don't know how I'm going to fix it. So it's going to be very interesting. We love sea life in this chat. Oh my God, I'm, we're not friends anymore. That's so awkward. Oh, you played for Art School, it's awesome. Ghost streams forever. <laughs> Seal your ARG starts here. That sucks, dude, but I mean, hey, I understand. You guys have mole rats and moles, so. <gasps> Tape your time. Thank you, Peeper. Funny. Yeah, we could be sea life besties. I love goblin sharks. Those guys are crazy. I was gonna say, like, why are you so, like, sad about giving out your Tumblr, girl? This dude is like definitely having a good snack. Aw, thank you. I'm so glad you like it. He's just having a little snack. This is for sure a gooby. You're so right about that, Peeper. Just a little dude, just hanging out, just having a little star snack. Doesn't get better than that.
All right, that is our whale shark having a little star snack. And now we're doing moth soup, Moshi Monsters. We're doing a pop it. Alex G's pretty good. Aw, bye, Bibu. Thank you so much for hanging out. I feel like I was born to draw a poppet, actually, now that I think about it. January gang. Aw, happy birthday, Basil. That's so exciting. Oh, that's a good question. Um, I'll definitely post them on my Tumblr and my Instagram. Um, I can also, if you have like an email or something you want to be contacted at that would work better for you, please let me know. That's a good idea, maybe I'll do that. Since I have contact info for everybody else. Um, I don't stream very often. Mostly because I don't really have the equipment for it. I only do them every once in a while. I think my last stream was like 10 months ago. Aw, oh, thanks. All these January birthdays, let's go. Yeah, mine was the 12th. Capricorn gang. Yeah, it's been a while, um, especially because my school got really busy and then I was kind of gone for a lot of the summer. Aw, I see your, I see your uh, chat, Miff. I'm so glad you like it. Wow, there's a lot of January birthdays. My favorite Pokemon is Togetic. <laughs> not your cat <laughs> Mabel left she, she got bored because there's no more pizza for her yeah free Palestine let's go oh Chikorita's cute always and forever
my family has a lot of March birthdays. We have a lot of people who are born in March in my family. Mm. Let's see, do I have like a pastel pink around here? It's not what I need. Yeah, I love Kiki's delivery service. <laughs> I watched it after I got really burned out when I'd first started my bakery job and I wasn't sure like if I was gonna like, if I was gonna be cut out for it. And I was like, wow, she's just like me. Peepers, that's really funny. <laughs> you said, I am here. Aw, see you, Toasty Bread. All right, there is our poppet. I'm gonna do get one more color for shading really quick. All right, that is our poppet. <laughs> Thank you so much. All right, so we have Bottle for Life, and then we have, who was the other YouTube donor? Was it L? Mods help, mods help, mods help. Mods help, I spilled my juice, mods, mods help. Yes, oh, okay, I, yes. Bye, Myth, thank you so much. Okay, uh, Bottle for Life. Which one is um, Bottle for Life? Which one did you want? No, no, I was, I was referencing that. The, okay, hold on. It's it's like the, like the picture of somebody, and it's like a screenshot, and they're like mods. They spilled my juice. Mods, mods, help, mods, mods. <laughs> I was, I was. Okay. <laughs> Anyways, I love miso soup. So true. Let me pull up the document that I have all of my little guys on. A lamb, and then we have Roxanne Wolf. Oh, sweet, awesome. That's an incredible request. Roxanne Wolf. I've only seen a little bit of Avatar, actually. Uh, believe it or not. I wasn't allowed to watch it as a kid. I don't think I've ever... I might have drawn a FNAF character like once before. Aw, that's so nice that you make miso soup for you guys. I love miso soup. It's such a comfort food.
<laughs> Welcome back, Jen. I love one shot. I have not been in a musical. And I really haven't played a lot of Legend of Zelda games. I feel like I would really like them though. Oh, I've helped with um, musical sets before. I've definitely been on like crew, but I've never really been like a theater kid. I'm giving her multiple cats. She's like in a pile of cats, I've decided. She's in kitty heaven. <laughs> Thank you. I'm having a really good time with it. She's in the cat zone. Kitty BFFs. What if puppies and kitties could be friends? What then? I am still streaming, baby. 
It has been six hours. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I did the shitposty start. Yeah, let me show you. Uh, where is he? It is... Um... Let's find him. There's a lot. There's a lot. The trolley, bro. Here he is! This one's for you, Sticks. <laughs> I'm so glad you like it. I'll send it to you after. <laughs> So glad. favorite FNAF character. See, like, I, I've i only played, like, the first game, so I only know the vibes, and I'm like, I feel like I'm a Chica girl. I feel like I'm a Chica girl. Like, I like her little party outfit. I think it's really cute. I don't know. Peeper, vibe check me. Yeah, I could definitely show you guys once I finish this one, and I'm gonna finish up um, Eyes as well, The Lamb, and then I can show you guys what I've done so far. Aw, oh, thank you. I'm glad you like it. I gave her a lot more cats than one. I said she will have one billion kitties. Not gonna catch my sleeve on fire. Hello, hi Ceaseless Watcher. Aw. Thank you so much. It's always really sweet to hear that my stuff like inspires people. It's like, dang, that's really cool. Hmm, I don't know what color would be good for the background. Probably like bluey, bluey purple. Someone asked for my opinion on bluey earlier. I like bluey, I think blue is really cute. I watched a lot of it when I was in the hospital very recently. My mom and I just sat in my hospital room watching bluey for like, three and a half hours.
I think it's really cute. Cute show. I think we need more shows like that. <laughs> right? I love that blue. That's just like the basic Crayola blue. And it's the best. It's so tasty. No problem. I can write Oliver on this for sure. Yeah, the backgrounds are gorgeous. All right, I believe this one is done. Make sure I got that right, Oliver. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Come on. All right, there we go. And then I can show you uh, the rest of this. This is the first one we started with, which was the dragon, the seasoned dragon. And then we have the moths, the little rosy maple moths. And then we have the tabby cat painting. And then the possum. And then we've got this little character right here. We've got the scary deer. And then <laughs> and then we have the rubber ducks. And then we have the sheep and the deer having a milkshake. We have the coyotes for Howdy. We've got Annabeth. We've got an angel with some fun birds. We've got this very cute character. And then, oh yeah, we have um, over here, we have this very fun character that I cut out because I didn't like the background. Um, we got a dragon, we got this cute dog, bunny with a strawberry, Scoofy shark, the trolley, this character, this drawing. This one got really bleedy. I have to go back and line it one more time. There's a jackalope, cowboy deer, whale shark, poppet, and now we're here. All right, I'm gonna do the last YouTube. Um, yeah, I've been drawing for six hours straight, so. <laughs> Let me get the lamb done, and then I think I'm gonna call it a night so I can go sleep and then uh, go feed some birds tomorrow morning. So let's do a lamb. of the birds up if I get some. I would not mind doing that.
Okay, let's paint this bad boy. <laughs> See a bottle, thank you so much for being here and thank you so much for donating. I don't think this is a great sketchbook for watercolor, honestly. It kind of buckles. <laughs> I don't mind using it, but it's not the best quality if you're going to be watercoloring. You really want like a mixed media. Oh, it's 11 11. FYI. Oh, sleeve got close to the fire there. Sleeve got very close to the fire there. There he is, just a little lamb, just a little guy. All right, I think that is going to wrap it up. Oh my goodness, <laughs> wrap it up for tonight. Um, I've got about, I wanna say like 10-ish extra drawings on Ko-Fi and possibly in my email as well, which I'll check out in a second let me plug this bad boy in so i can figure out how to save the vod um which i'm gonna do before i sign off just so that like i don't screw this up oh uh, come on come on back there buddy yeah thank you guys so much for being here all right let's see how do i Save this so it doesn't disappear. All right, Googling it right now. Okay, I have to go to YouTube Studio. Yes, Free Palestine. Thank you guys so much. It really, really means so, so much. Um, I... Oh, thank you guys so much. Let me see. How do I get on the studio? Come on. Okay, it looks like it automatically archives them. 
which is great, as long as it's under 12 hours, which we are under 12 hours. Okay, sweet. In that case, I... Okay, awesome. <laughs> All right, guys. Um, thank you so, so much. I really, really appreciate you guys and everybody who donated. It was just so cool to see so many people turn up for this and to donate so much money so generously. Um, and I will get to work on getting all this money where it needs to go. I cannot believe how much we raised. Um, I, I'll have to total it, but like, it's more than I thought. <laughs> um, so it's really cool and I'd love to do something like this again soon. So thank you, thank you very, 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 very much. Um, and I will see you, uh, stop it again. See you guys again next time. All right, bye-bye.